Run a good bear and breakfast. Hell yeah. Bye. Bye. You want any ice cream? Talking to me? Yeah. No, thanks. Hey, you chat. That's cozy. Loading. Look at that shot, dude! Holy shit! Holy crap! Yes! Lance Reddick is always good. He was so good in the show. Hell yeah. I love him. Love the man. Yeah, he was a highlight. I want him to be in like better stuff. He's such a good actor. He has been in legendary oh, to, stuff. We need to change the title apparently. Yeah, he's been in a lot of good stuff. I just want him to be in more good stuff. He should lead his own John Wick style action movie. Yeah, I mean that was my hope for the um, the Continental show is that he would be like the the through line, like the glue between a bunch of these random assassins coming is and going. Is that not the premise? I hope it's the premise. It should be the premise. Does that show exist? I don't know actually. Do I know if this game sports controller or no? No. Uh -huh. Not right now. Then we're gonna... Not right now. It said. Woo. Here comes the table! Here comes the sun! Be doo dee doo! Fringe, dude! Fringe hype. Hey, what? What is that over there? Oh! Chat doesn't want you to play with these anymore. Really? Yeah. Who, who in chat? Rebirth? Several other people? Oh, uh, let's steal those poker chips. Okay. Alright. <laughs> Alright. So be it. I know. I love it. So be we it. We all love it. The feel. It soothes my anxiety, but it's cool. We need to get you a quiet fidget device. <laughs> quiet poker chips. Wait, is Lance Reddick in Leftovers? Leftovers. Okay. No. 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 Okay, bye. Okay, bye. You don't want any ice cream, right? Does blood want ice cream? Whoa. Shall we begin, Damiani? Uh, shall we begin? I don't really know what's up with this game, other than we're running uh. a bed and breakfast as a bear. I'm a little concerned, Damiani, because it's like survival crafting management vibes. Uh-huh. And I'm pretty bad at that stuff. You gotta love this, Huber. Right. I gotta say this. I won't name the place. The other, was it two weeks ago, three weeks ago? Yeah. Had the issue with my stomach, like I felt like nauseous and stuff. Yeah. But like, I don't feel nauseous right now. Yeah. But like, this, after we finished reaction or whatever, and I got up, same thing with like hit my stomach really hard. Uh, same place I went to. I'm I'm wondering. I'll say this: it's like it's like pre-made sushi. Oh God. From a from a market, and it's a Japanese market. Oh okay, like a Mitsuo type. So I want to know what the hell's going on. Like, yeah. why am I getting this from? Like, do they like? Yeah, I was like. Yeah, pre-made sushi is a little sketchy. They, unless are they, you are they, source, uh, are they changed their sourcing here. It's like, yeah. eating this place for like a decade, and now last two times I've gone there, it's a. Uh, it's like uh no, it's like the the rolls and stuff. It's not like sashimi yeah. or anything like that. Whoa. So I'm wondering if they got like parasites in it or some crap. Look at this freak. Yeah. So I am apologizing in advance. I might have to get up a lot to chat. I'm sorry. Chat, can you see the game? They should. Cool. Yeah, I see the text box. This looks a little dark. Glowing eyes. Yeah, it's showing up now. Whoa! Is this Ori? <laughs> a shriek pierced through the air. Feels like Ori. I feel like every single game ever now has 45 minutes of plot up front. Like, what happened to just like dive in, in man? <laughs> what was the game we played? The Spider Soars. Yeah, that was so, so dude. Great. I was kind of into that game, watching the trailer, and then on group stream, 
first 20 minutes, I'm like, I'm kind of out now, yeah. guys. Like, what the hell? Like, yeah. you can have story, but like, Shredder's Revenge, mm -hmm. like, yeah. sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle sprinkles. It. It's like, it's like the sprinkles on top. It's not, Straight up. it's not even the whipped cream. It's like, it's not even that, shouldn't even be that thick. When it comes to, uh, comes to anything but like a, like Naughty Dog. Love Naughty Dog. A lot of people hate Naughty Dog. Does this feel good? You it actually does, it actually does, it actually you feels good. You are the bear. Yeah. Feels good. <laughs> Sleep. Let's take a nap in the death bed. Come on, man. Interact with it. Interact on, with man. it. Interact with it. Come on. Come on. Shiva. 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 Come on. Shiva, come come on. on. Wait. Wait. Wake. Who's this? Whoa. Freak show. Nefarious right here. Yeah. Louder tapping chat want demands. No more dumplings before bed. I don't think I wouldn't recommend eating dumplings before bed. Hank. I don't recommend eating many things before bed. Better see what's up. Dude, literally says it's a nice room and it's like a cave. Chimney unlocked. Oh, that's a door right there? Okay. Yeah, it's like in a cave, man. But the bare necessities. I'm already overwhelmed. Cool, cozy. Hey, does that mean you can't go outside the door? Is that just the wreath? <gasps> can't leave! Can't Not leave. letting you leave! You're a prisoner in your own home. Okay. This is overwhelming. This is too cluttered for me. Good luck, Huber. Yeah. Nice, cozy game. Yeah. Nice, relaxing game. Yeah. I'm up! I'm up! Why aren't you a bag of bones? Good to see hibernation hasn't kicked in yet. You can't call that every time I get a little extra sleep. Besides, besides what? I had a hard time sleeping. Too many thoughts. Well, that runs in the family. Have you tried thinking less? Wow. Gee, thanks, Mom. No, I'm... Where's Annie? Oh, I'm in a room with Will, probably. I should go wake him up. All right, honey. The basics. Okay, walk around. Zoom the camera in, got it. Nice. nice. All right, that's good. Okay. Different things over there. Let's E. It's oh. <laughs> gonna sneeze. It is an auto save. Oh my God! Is that supposed to be the <laughs> meme? Is that the meme image? No. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> that's good. Settings. <clears throat> okay. Gotta go wake up Annie. Starlight. Uh, there's down. So give your own separate. You can go right now, right? Yeah. Good. Get out. Morning. Out. It's not very good morning of you. There's nothing good about being up this early. Yeah, straight up, Will. Straight up. Good morning suck. What do you mean? I can smell them a mile away. Delightful. Both of you. It's on the docket today, boss. Digging a new hole next to the other holes. Actually, Mom said she might let us cross the creek today and check under the bushes for mushrooms. What did I tell you? I live for the hunt. We never do fun stuff anymore, like visit the old dumpster. Not on past the fence, dude. Poachers. It's not good. <clears throat> so much lore. Jesus. He just wants to get into it. He wants to be outdoors. So much lore in video games. He, he just wants to explore now. Let God. Him out. Let him out. <laughs> Every game. 40 minutes. Prep. It's like, I don't even want to be violent, chat. I'm a bear, I want to just build in peace. Pick up adventure mode. So are we in adventure mode right now? 
Oh yeah. Yo, coins, dude. Economy. Here we go. Economy. You're ready to spend. Use filters. Throw away. Mini map. I always like. Good stuff. Zoom in, zoom out. A little zoom, like a little bit of zoom. Zoom, zoom, zoom. A lot more zoom. Pretty cool house. Yeah, man. Hobbits. 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 The Hobbits. The Hobbits. Yo, it feels good to just wander around here. It, it, I like it. Yeah, this looks like an old school Super Nintendo RPG right now. Yeah. Walking around. By the way, Huber did see the uh, old man uh, traveling game from Annapurna. <laughs> Fucking, what is it? Forever Young or Forever Ago? Ages Ago? What is it? What the hell is it? It's, uh... Huber's in. I'm a hundred percent in. I'm a billion percent in. Forever ago. Forever ago! Yes. Sign me up. Why? What's Xenon? What, what's, is that a game? What, what's Xenon? Xenon. I have no idea. Is it like Power Rangers? Like, hey, Ma. Alpha, Rita's escapes. Recruit, uh, recruit teenagers with attitude. On the hunt. On the She's hunt. She's ready for the hunt. Uh, yeah, I've been avoiding, I've been trying, but I have seen the Metacritic average because too many people I follow tweet tweeted it, the average. For what? For Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Got so it. I know what the Metacritic is. Rule of thumb, if a game is over 50 hours, it needs to be a nine or a 10, or I'm not playing it. Wait, what? Yeah, I'm not playing a 50 hour, seven out of 10 game or eight out of 10, dude. I'm just not doing it. A 15, so a 15 hour, eight out of 10 game is a no to you. I'm saying 50 hours. Oh, yeah. okay. 50. I was about to say, humor. No, what, what's, what, where are we? Like, how, like, like JRPG length, oh, okay. dude. It's got to be so, the best. So, okay, so 50. 50. Five zero. So, what's the score? It has to be at least. Like a 9 or a 10. So, even 8.5 is not high enough for 50 hour. 8.5 is like. It would be. Other factors would have to, like, get me to, get okay. me to commit. Yeah. Gotcha. But usually, if a game's super long. I'm not gonna settle for swimming there, dude. Like, okay, swim too long there. Yeah. Get, get your prune up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. <laughs> pool's, yeah. pool's closed. <laughs> pool's closed. You're swimming. You're chilling. Uh, hours of operation. <laughs> yes, there you dude. Go. There you go. Yeah. If it's if it's like tens and tens of hours, that game's got to be one of the best. Like a Witcher 3 quality. All right. All Persona right. 5 quality, All like right. Dragon Quest quality. Xenoblade 1 probably, you know, everyone always says it's the best. Heber's rules on the video game length <laughs> and scores. I don't know if you heard. I heard him laughing and that's why I came in It here. has to be a nine, eight, eight, nine or higher, nine to, or be, higher. to play a five zero hour game, 50 hour game. Sure. Or longer. Yeah. And I asked him about, what about 8.5? And he's like, other factors would need to be considered. Yeah, like the allies would have to be like, you gotta play this. Chat yeah, would have, have to be, to be like, like, yo. A personal match. Yeah. And then we said, he says, I'm not swimming in that seven for what, that long? And I said, yeah, you could be pruning up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Pruning up. I love the look of that bear. Super so has set so many rules that he never sticks to. <laughs> oh, yeah, he can't remember any of them. Well, my rules constantly change. Yeah, shift it to your whim. Yeah. Huber, I would imagine, I know I saw it late, and you ended up doing it yourself when you sat down the computer. Yeah. I would imagine you were driving when you sent me that image of the code for this game. No, I was uh, getting gas, actually. Oh, okay. Yeah. Don't text and drive, chat. 10%. I drive up with Brad all the time. We carpool. When he's driving, I'll just look outside the window to other people driving. Oh, yeah. And. Oh, yeah. One in 10. It doesn't seem like a lot, but it's actually it an insane like amount. 10%, like, 
on average, looking at their phone, saw a really good one the other day. Good one. Really good one here, okay? They're driving 75 good? miles an hour on the 405 freeway, one of the most hostile, dangerous places to drive. Like, Los Angeles, Southern California, 405, rush hour chaos. Guys driving with full-on noise-canceling headphones. That, which is illegal. Okay. You can't drive with headphones. Fucking noise-canceling. One wheel on the wheel. One wheel, like, dude was probably watching Stranger Things on his phone. Had the phone above the wheel with noise canceling headphones like this. It's like, what is happening? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think you can only have one ear covered. You have to have one ear open for sound. It's against the law. Chaos, dude. Yeah. And especially if it's noise canceling, you have to be able to hear horns and. Like emergency vehicle sirens, you like if you, you're canceling it so you can't hear him. Yeah, that's the whole point. Defeats the purpose. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, who needs Vecna when there's phones? <laughs> Seriously. Look at this. What's this going on in the little adventure right here? But Huber, the the thing that was a good tangent. But I was gonna say it just amazed me that Huber Huber sent me that an image of the code. Yeah. From an email when he could have just copy pasted the code from the email. I tried actually, it wouldn't work. Okay. Because okay. on my phone, I was trying to like do it. And it was just like, do you want to forward this? And I was like, no, copy the, copy paste the code. And it, but it was like embedded in. So I was like, ah. Uh, so I was good. just like, well, fucking screenshot, whatever. <laughs> Cheerful oh. and curious. Those are two good qualities. No, Ma, I'm definitely not going to want her too far in adventurous fashion. Whoa. Yo, when are we going there? Horror elements. Spread out! Find some alligator weed. Alright. Well, these jolly lanterns is hanging around. Mm -hmm. You can't walk on this. Stuff. I don't know water. Like water. Okay. It looked like rock. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's, the darkness isn't helping. Oh, it's like the arrow is like telling you it's right up there. Dude, speaking of darkness. There's something glowing up there. Is that it? Do you see the new Thor? No, I haven't seen it yet. It reminded me of the darkness. The oh, game. this is made in Europe. Tire screech. Spell the Y. <laughs> yeah. You ever play the darkness? No. We have to go back, Kate. Yeah, if you take public transportation, you could uh, listen and watch all you want. Exactly. The heads in the full head. You wear the headphones. Good luck finding reliable and efficient public transportation in Los Angeles. Mm -hmm. It's not possible. It's very specific, like you have to be on a specific spot for a specific route because LA is just too big. The only time, it's just too the only time in my life I used public transportation a lot, and I, I was, for my perspective, it was good, but like obviously it was like, the first time I was using it was uh, in college. Nice, yeah. Uh, San Francisco. The, the college, amazing. yeah, the college had a bus system and it came like right by where we lived, one of the stops. And then yeah, went around everywhere. Took it to took it to school and took it to took it home every day. Like once or like two times a semester, I wouldn't take it because I'd be like running late and I needed to drive. And I would like because parking on campus was trash, so yeah. I'd have to like just deal with it on like one or two days I was running late. Timber Crossing, good environment. Yeah, 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 yeah. The car stuff now is scary as crap about all the car prices and stuff. Yo, Alan Wake right here. I guess. If I could take, so the only reason I mean, I would consider it, the only reason 
in the current situation because we only have to like come down two days right now. Um, and the days are kind of long. My only thing is like in the evening lately, I like to get home as soon as I can. So Cloud will calm down because uh, he starts to get worked up when I'm gone for too long. Yeah. Um, or if someone doesn't like, uh, like come, like he wants like food and I can't use an automatic feeder with his wet food. Uh, they only make them for dry food and the wet food ones aren't like good and the vet told me probably to n not use them because like if they don't work right or something, it could cause an issue. Um, so I give him food before I leave. I've been having my roommate give him food before he does his stuff. So like around like four or five, he starts doing his work and he's like, busy so like I can't have he can't come out so like there's a window from around like 4 or 5 p.m. to like when I get home which could be like 9 or later 9 is like the earliest I'll get home and yeah that that time period there he gets like if I take too long to get home he gets like really agitated so I would probably not that would be my only issue is like having to like wait on the public transportation the time yeah like, I will step onto my floor of my apartment complex. It's not that long of a hallway to, on the, for how the, it, its layout is. But as soon as I take that first step on that floor, he somehow knows it's me. I hear him meowing, like, out, like, from outside. Walking out, like, along the wall outside of our apartment. I hear him, and it's like, okay. He is not happy. I play Fortnite with my buddy Grumbomb and Grumbaum smokes a lot of marijuana. And every night he's like, yeah, there's this spider that like hangs out by my window and he keeps like blowing smoke at it. And it'll like, every time he does, it'll like wander to a spot back and forth, just back and forth. It's so it's like wandering. And he's literally... Are you sure he's seeing this and not... Like, it's been a die. week. It's okay. been a full <laughs> okay. week of this. He's like, he texted me yesterday. He's like, yo, the spider's still hanging out. <laughs> you gotta be careful with that. Uh, I had a spider uh, hanging on my ceiling in my bathroom that moved to a spot. Uh, I, I watched it move like over a few hours. Like I kept going back in there every so often. And it stopped at a spot, and I thought it was just like, it got too close, like I was too close, so I thought it was just like, oh, it's just like, you know, chilling till like, I go away for long enough. Like, stood there for like two days, I'm like, oh, I'm pretty sure it's dead. And like, on day three, like, looked at my floor, and it was just like, on the floor dead. Yeah. I was like, yeah, it's like, sometimes I don't have a long lifespan, so like, going back and forth like that, if it's been hanging out there for a few days, it might not be around much longer, yeah. <laughs> experience enticing escape electronic enterprise pawn voyage get it pawn voyage pretty gentle what you would like to own the next minor share in the next major maneuver multinational multi-layered multi-year friend corporation <laughs> there's the meme again the yeah, y equals ax squared Price from the jewelry or spends a very limited choice and we'll give you a one to three day all inclusive voucher for the vacation of a lifetime. Millions of customers? They have millions of customers. Hell yeah, do you go to the forest and forget the world? Humans are whack. I read in a magazine, must be true. time, I think. <laughs> Stand to make a boatload of cash. No idea what you just said. Humans are coming and they're going to give us money. Tell the shark we're in. We're in, shark. All right. legally binding agreement. 
Welcome to the family. Mafia, dude. Lone shark. Hmm. Who's in there? <clears throat> so much lore. So much lore. Special no. options, okay. Visibility. Okay, it's like uh, walls and shit. Okay. Go to sawdust through timber crossing. Will do. Yo, we've been uh, saving some materials, which is nice. It's the worst when you gotta progress by building something and you don't have the right mats. Not fun. It's a tough call. I won't know which one I like more until we sit down and talk about them for goodies. Those are my two favorites this year, though, for sure. For sure. They're both games I always want to just boot up and play for like 30 minutes or three hours, you know? Heirlooms chat, Rogue Legacy 2, good song. <clears throat> 10 out of 10, song. I hope Bloodworth listens to that soundtrack. Cause it's effing good. Always wanted to go to that drive-through tree chat. Where is that? What state is that in? The drive-through tree? Anyone know? It's like the big tree with the, it's like cut out. Mirror woods, yeah, I think you're right. I think it is in California, holy shit. I'm in California. That's close. You can't drive through it anymore? What? What? The dream is dead. Lame. Need for Speed Hot Pursuit 2010? That sounds right. It's crazy. Alright, what do you want? Mole Man, Beaver Man, by God, a bear! It's just me, sir. Hank from the thicket. Hey, old boy, how's your mother? She's great. Listen, I want to ask if you'd help us. Humans to the valley. We haven't seen those in a while. Can teach us how to build. All right. Now what the hell? 
talk again, right? Yeah, there we go. Yep. Finishing quest, chat. Progression. Forward progression. Take your stuff. Meet Tony back in Timber Crossing. I like the waypoints. It's very nice. <laughs> Little arrows. Easy to get lost out here. The Terrace, that was a fun game. I think Tommy Oni reviewed that maybe or I never finished that one. That was cool. Finished House of Ashes the other night. I've been replaying Dark Pictures solo. Just for funsies. I'm playing Ollie Ollie World on the side. Love Ollie Ollie and Ollie Ollie too. Welcome to Ollywood. So fun. And I'm a Red Dead 2, as you know, chat. <laughs> Red Dead 2. Red Dead 2. You see him, child. Let me know. Hmm. Took. Professional trash talker at your disposal. There Tony is. Nice. Alright. Clean it up. Didn't I already do that? I already did that. I'm ahead of the game. Finishing quests. Already did that too. Repairing objects. Build and craft in that area. Monuments will improve the status of the area. Area, nice. Passages will be cleared and bridges will be repaired. Dope. Confirm it. That's a lot of mats, but. Luxurious outhouse. Built. Plus one extra guest request per day. You get that workbench fixed. Like brand spanking new. Whew. I appreciate that animation there. Achievements are popping. Pop, pop, pop. Once repair the workbench is used to craft and place objects as well as build rooms. Got it. 
So you buy the blueprints? All right, Chad, it's getting overwhelming. Once you start building shit, that's that's when I'm I'm overwhelmed. Oh, you do it at the, okay. Craft a bit. A bed right here, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bed. Boom. Okay. Exit. Okay. I think we did that right. Were you able to make that bed? Absolutely. Maybe you're worse than the schematics, but here we are. <laughs> Rude. Better than mine back home. Okay. Okay, use the bench to build rooms. Chat. <laughs> build a bedroom. Hope for the best. Build a room. It's a tiny ass bedroom. Enjoy your tiny little closet room. <laughs> yeah. Yo, know, we did it. We did it, chat. Better. Yeah. Yeah. Build mode, you can always place furniture objects freely. Burp. Burp, burp, burp. Timber Crossing. Is that the name of the building or the area? Area. Nice. Yeah. Love a good quest tracker. Hell yeah. Using the workbench, craft a front desk. Okay, craft, so, boom. Front desk. We need to get some like Animal Crossing music playing chat. There you go. Craft a front desk. What the fuck? Here we go. Front desk. Here it is, right here, right here. Front desk. Craft. Boom. Uh, and then inventory, and you just pop. You click it, and you, there you go. Nice. So what does the highlighted area around it like mean? No idea. Yeah. Maybe where it can drop. Ah, I, yeah. Yeah. Boom. Looks good. Hell yeah. <laughs> oh, so you got this construction guy, this beaver. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Nice. I didn't watch the Mario Kart 8 trailer, no. New map! Crazy! Oh, yeah. Update 2. New map. DLC part 2. Man, they just, they just piecemealed everything for the second half of this year, haven't they? 
Hey, you know what? We're almost to August, which means... Dude, look at this. Look at this guy. People, dude. He's like, that guy looks like he belongs at the beach, not, yep. not a bed and breakfast. What is going on? Like, maybe it's the lighting, but like, he looks like he's got sunscreen on his nose. Yeah. But it's lighting. I can tell like, on his hand he's got it, too. But it's like, this guy looks like he just came from the club. Um, she looks at home in the, in the woods. Looks a little bit more relaxed. All right, here we go. Scientist looking guy, all right. That That's a crew. Mr. your Resorts, what up? Wait, Waluigi's Pinball? Was there a what new... Up? Are you gonna join us? I can. Hey, join us for a minute. We're trying to build a. Oh, the guy's shop house called for people. Pond Voyage. I missed okay. that. I got to zoom the camera out. All right. Sick. Wait, let me clean my glasses as I Hell came in yeah. here. <laughs> this is getting out of hand, chat. Out of control. Out of control. You know that song? No. Sandstorm. You know Sandstorm? Um, streaming, Mom. Yeah, I'm no, I'm, I'm on stream right now. Bear and breakfast. October 29th. Will I be back home on the 30th? Oh, yeah, then I'm in, yeah. <laughs> That's uh, Halloween Eve. It's a very special day for me. <laughs> Great. <laughs> cool. Yeah. All right, I love you. Oh my God. All right. All right, bye. Hubert, it's just precious that you had to, like, I know it's your mom, and I feel like your mom knows, already knows about you, but you're just reiterating Halloween's a special day. Well, because she's like, do you want to go to a wedding? And I'm like, when is it? And she's like, October 29th. So I'm like, is this going to be like multiple nights? Like, I, I just got to be home on the 30th, you know, the 31st, Halloween. <laughs> Big deal. Just tell your you mom Halloween's a special yeah. day. Special for day, me. dude, the 30th. She's like, what's going, she's like, what's going on on the 30th? Okay. I'm like, dude, it's Halloween time. What do you do for Halloween? I watch spooky movies all month. Okay. Yeah. I go through like. Probably be playing. Uh, I go through the classics. The Devil like, in Me. Wait. Devil in Me will be going down. Yeah, some horror games, some horror movies, some horror shows. It's important. It Village is. DLC. Wait, does that come out in October as well? Yeah. Holy crap! We're gonna have a fun October. Yeah. We should do like Spooktober. I don't care any of this shit, Chad. All of this, I don't care all of this. All of this. This is supposed to be a soothing game. Yeah, this, this, this soothing game, this and everyone's having breaking menus point. pop up. Huber's, Huber's just like, like, I'm freaking he's out. Like, no, 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 no. I'm, the I'm just like that. Like, I need too much. Um, too much there. I need mechanics to be taught to me so slowly. Yeah. Oh man, yeah. that was too much. It was too much. All right, front desk. Where do those humans go? Look at this. What was the point? Awesome. Of, yeah, what was the human thing that cuts into the humans? They're coming. They're coming now. All right. Okay. So we assign... Like, look at this shit. What is happening? Guest requests. Comfort. Accept. Assign. Did we assign it? That was probably in the instructions. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's in. He's in. He arrives tomorrow. Do you have build more? Lewis. You gotta build more bedrooms because you got more guests coming. Dude, you got people leaving you reviews. Yeah, that's. Terrible. You've got no active staff. Oh, we did either. it, we did it, we did it. Another quest done. You don't need it. You, you got it. Can we, like, yeah, we gotta pump this guy's place. Pump it up, pump it up. Pump, pump, pump it up. You own the bed and breakfast? Or you're an employee? We co own We made a deal. Own. With some, a okay. loan shark. With a loan shark? An actual loan shark. Yeah, like look, a at shark? This. look at this. Look at this. Oh my yeah. god! Yeah. That's awesome. Pawn voyage. Pawn voyage. voyage. Yeah. It's perfect. Have right. you ever been to a bed and breakfast? 
Either of you? Once, and it was amazing. Yeah. Oh, I like French toast chat over waffles or pancakes. I think I like French toast the best as well, but I like waffles over pancakes. Same. And only if there's real maple syrup. I refuse to eat that other shit. <laughs> Prestige. So we gotta like make it better. It's ugly. Oh, Huber is just breezing through this. <laughs> too much lore. Huber's like it's, also, yeah. by the way, Huber said there's too much lore in this game way as well. Way too much. So <gasps> what do you mean? This is not the. And I'm reading it. I'm reading it quick. I'm giving, I'm giving you the cliff notes, chat, if they say anything really important. They just call our building ugly and we need to raise it. Raise it up. Can you punch? Take him out? No attacks, rude? thankfully. Because oh, okay. people would accidentally be mauled at this point. <laughs> Prestige. So we just need to decorate. That's right, decorate. That's fun. Picking up trash. Classic survival games, just picking up junk off the ground. <laughs> Is this a survival game? <laughs> I, it's survival, like, what do you mean? It's building resource management. management? Yeah, resource management, yeah. I guess, specifically. Okay, we gotta get it to two. Can we buy? Here we go. How much money? Oh, 190. We don't have a lot. Gold. Yo, we need this though. Dude, you buy one? I thought, oh, it's the recipe though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Oh my God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, dude, you gotta buy them each. And they go up in price each <laughs> That'd time. That'd be nuts. All right, build, craft. Here we go. Simple. Crafting recipe, how do I, do I have to like use it in the, the inventory maybe? There it is, boom. As soon as there's more than like five words on the screen that aren't subtitles, my mind just goes blank. Same. All right, here we go. Oh, no, and then we go to build mode. Oh, it's gotta be like in the bedroom, huh? Son of a bee. <laughs> oh no! How do we edit the room? Build mode. Chat, how do we do this? What do I, uh, oh. Go down. Lower right? Lower right? Yeah. Crafting, it's crafting. It's oh. Crafting. No, 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 no. Huber no, is no, like, no. what are the other two arrow things? Okay, I just wanna, I wanna move this wall the out. What are the bottom right corner things in that thing? What do those do? Show walls. Um, Ooh, it's like the, the Sims. What's the other one? Show floors? Damn. Okay. I know if there's something like click and dem like, where's dismantle or demolish? What are your other tabs? Can I like. What tabs? Uh, where the exclamation mark is? Do you have like anything that's like. Oh, that's mm. quest. I know if there's like. Demolish. What's. And the red X just closes that window? The bottom yeah, left? Yeah. Damn, I thought that was like delete. Uh oh. Dude, did you build that room? You can add another. Yeah, I don't think you have a big enough. I don't think you can. Like, see, you only have the ability to build those types of bedrooms right now. I, so you I, need a bigger space. I, I know. I, do, I just want to push this wall up. You can't. They don't let you do that in this game. Like, it's okay. you build rooms based on the specs. Okay. Yeah. So you only have a two by three at so max. So if the there's a smaller dresser. So we'll just have another bedroom. But it won't you fit it. it. Yeah. Yeah. It's only a two by three. You need. Oh, here we go. No, no, yeah, yeah. No, yeah. that's not how it works. Two by, two by three. Two, two by three. One, two, one, two, one. Two. That's three. It'd be that's that, two by three. That's one more bedroom, but it won't. That'll be fit. the same size. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what are you What are you telling me? Two by three means <laughs> what are you six me? grids. What are you telling Two rows, three columns means six. Make six. There. Oh, big size. Dude. Okay. Big size. Okay. I guess it doesn't work that way. Never mind. Wait, 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 wait. What is happening? All right, now put the. I'm trying. Where's the door? I need a door. Wait, so the the door to that bedroom is in the other bedroom? I need a door. Why didn't you put it? In this I don't know how to play. <laughs> okay, okay. All right, Huber, so it's okay. Like, we're like good. To play? Do you like to play something more soothing, Huber? I'm just looking for a door, dude. Chat, where'd those doors go? Doors. Crafting. <laughs> No. I 
Fine, oh, it. it's gone. <laughs> okay. Okay. Comfort. Right here. Wait, 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 wait. Before you put it there, that that blocks that door. So why don't you put it in the back, like on the same like here. latitude? Yeah, yeah. Longitude is okay. the latitude. And there's there's the door. Amazing. We found it. Yes. Boom. Nice. Dresser. No need to freak out. Here we you got go. it. Dresser. Right where you walk in. Okay, that's a good spot for it. <laughs> yeah. So when you open the doors, the yeah, it's <laughs> right there. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Good stuff, Uber. Put, put a bed in there. Okay. Doing that will discard. No, you don't want to do that. No. Keep. How do you keep? Oh, we need the. Oh, that's so frustrating. You like have to do it in one go. Come on, dude. Okay. Oh, you have to have everything <laughs> in order to build a room. Yes. Okay. Yes. There we go. We've got it all downloaded now. Bedroom. Boom. Door. Wardrobe. Here, right, right in front of the door for you, Damiani. The bed. <laughs> Why don't you put it next to the door? Right, Can you put more than one bed in a room? Rotate. Look at that. How's that? Cozy. Oh, yeah. Love. Oh, yeah. Nice. We don't have enough money. I was about to say, Huber. <laughs> we don't have enough money. You're in the, you're in the red, Huber. Okay. Huber's in the red. All right. Okay, game. Maybe make a smaller room? <laughs> I don't know how to make it that big. I just wish I could, like, expand the room. Like. Yeah, that seems a little. It's crazy. Crazy. All right. How do you get, buddy? I think the guests have walk to into come. the road. <laughs> get in my car. Home improvements. Ooh. Whoa there, big fella. Did you name your character? No. Hank is canon. Scrap. Love scrap. Top 10 video game resources, scrap. <laughs> Bus Depot. I'm a snack. Wow. Give me all this junk. Give me all your junk. Right in here, I bet. The, the f Find a sandwich. Oh, is that the bus depot? I don't even know what this is. Search the ruins. <laughs> Last of Us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Some ammo in here. <laughs> Find a Molotov. This looks like the bus station. Find yeah. that tuna. Can't open that. We got near a crowbar. Is it inside? No. Hey, this guy's got a sandwich. Oliver. Cute. <laughs> I love how they only hear bear noises yeah. when you talk to them, even though you think you're trying to talk. Mild bear noises. <laughs> Can you find a way to sawdust? We got quests for days now. Well, there, can you go into the bus depot through that Is door? Is it nighttime now? Mm -hmm. oh. I want to talk to that guy first. Oh, okay. Did this become nighttime? No, it says day. Well, there's a light street lamp on, so. Where's it say day? No, it's day three. Ah, yeah. yeah. I gotta say, because the lighting just changed when you finished that convo. Yeah, where's this tuna? Um. There you go. Got Huber. it. There you go. Got it. Finishing quest, dude. Knocking them down. I appreciate the small quests. Mm -hmm. Getting, you know, it, it's like motivates me. It makes me feel good. Feels like Cuber's making progress. Exactly. Calms the nerves. Calms the nerves. Took's garbage. One by it's probably two, right? Because that's what they call a beanie in Canada. Really? Yeah. Always with one interesting fact, Cappy, every time. I know one fact about everything. Ten out of ten facts. 
I'm just a know it all. <laughs> Snitch. Humans coming back in droves. So much lore. Love a good kiosk. Yeah. Roller coaster tycoon information yeah. kiosk. One of my favorite things to build. Dude, Roller Coaster Tycoon, we should play that. I love Roller Coaster Tycoon. Has Zoo Tycoon, that's Zoo my favorite tycoon. one. Dude, has Dawn Dude. streamed Roller Coaster Tycoon? Oh no. If not, that is insane and needs to happen. Well, we gotta get him in here to watch the, uh, the Lost Wild trailer. Hell yeah. Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 was my favorite. Logan, my child. Dawn is a roller coaster chat. <laughs> Talking about the kiosk for the humans. Up. Building it. Oh, now my mom's calling. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Halloween. Hello. Yeah. Hi, Keep Halloween open. Keep Halloween open. Apples, junk food oh. cores. Oh, that's cute that you pay to the in trash. I guess I don't have like a big map yet. Get the daily dinky shed prestige to level two. So we gotta like pump up this building down here, I guess, is like kind of our main bus sign. Uh, bus sign. Get a bus sign for the bus stop? Great question. Hmm. Right behind that door. Yeah. Oh, are these like on the wall? Like, like, it goes on like a desk. Yeah. Same with that. Got it. Well, maybe not. Not actually. Maybe not. This. I can just go there. Yeah. <laughs> that poster. Oh man, it's just floating there. Is so weird to me. <laughs> what? What? There you go. There you, go. <laughs> All right. Did you just discard the other one. No, I only had one. Oh no, you were clicking something else and I discarded it. No, no, never mind. It is a little lamp. Oh, okay. Oh. I see. Very cozy. There's fucking doors and windows, man. Right up here. <gasps> Needed that. Prestige, you know, level two? It seems kind of hard. I don't know what it's at either. Maybe on the details? Yeah, okay. So we gotta pump it out a little more. We were at two, now we're at six. Just flood it with random useless items, I guess? Photos and whatnot. 
foot rest, sure. Why not? Get those recipes. Hmm. Here. You telling you to go back to him. Okay. What is this? Rug? Sure. It's a mirror? Yeah, like a broken mirror. Nightstand. Power base. Alright, let's try that chat. Maybe it'll be enough. Got it. Got a contract like a contractor, like a decorator, home decorator. They'll help you out, Huber. They'll get you to that second level prestige in no time. And promised land. That Huber density right now. Hell yeah. Just packing all that stuff. Pack in it in, pack it in. What do we got? Yeah, what's the stats on it? Three Twelve, more, three, three more, three more. more. Oh man, so close. Was there a better quest? Get a book on spelling from the thicket. Get an old computer from sawdust. Oh, we didn't build the little dresser. We could do that. What else do we have of this? Proper box. Yeah. This side up. Sure. Snake! Snake! You play Metal Gear Gabby at all? No, not really. Is that the poster? I own Metal Gear Solid 5, but nice. never played it. <laughs> I haven't played it in so long. Long ass time. Cardboard box. <laughs> oh. Just ran in cardboard box. Just throw it in there, who cares? Just throw it in, we'll cover it in. <laughs> yeah, sure. That's a little... Gotta go in a bedroom. Yep. yep. Ah. Don't have the gold. You don't have the money. Son of a... <laughs> <laughs> economy! <laughs> economy! <laughs> Economy's getting us. <sighs> we might have beat one away. We did it! We hit it! We hit it! Oh, you did it. Good. We hit it. Go we hit it. That quest. Yes! We hit it. Yes! Press that green button. Quarter percent. Alright. Another quest. Probably wants to get to three. Yep. Complete this day for plus two guests in Timber Crossing. So I guess guests are gonna come soon. I don't really know how that works. Probably like a map over. <laughs> what is it? I like, don't know how I got here. <laughs> maybe this way? Uh, looks like this is the end of this map. Oh, right maybe here. you go. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Sawdust. Sawdust. Sweet. Ooh, Fire Watch Tower. Fire Watch. Good game. Good game. I like it. I like it too. I love games like that. I'm always down. Yeah, my roommate who doesn't play games basically at all, that's her favorite game. Favorite game? Yeah. Number one game yeah. ever. Yeah. Firewatch. Uh, that and then very close, probably inside. 
Damn, Firewatch over inside. I think Bold. she just liked the she liked the, the vibes. vibes. The mood. It's such a mood. Yeah. What a mood that came. What a mood. Dude, look at all this free lumber. Hell yeah. That's something. Go up the go up the tower. Oh. Yeah. Oh, so sleep in there. Be careful. So hype. Disturb their sleep. Really it's not. Whoa. Sweet. 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 <laughs> Make bear noises. <laughs> ah. <laughs> awesome. Oh dang. Any hype. It's like interesting. GHK2D puts it. Humor plays these games like there's zombies <laughs> about to invade. <laughs> like he's prepping for the apocalypse. Sure. Sure. <laughs> sure. Yep. Pretty much. Nice, Mish. They can help you with the map. Hell yeah. Pump. There you go, compass. Clutch, nice. Clutch, One clutch. step closer. Here we go. Area map. Clutch. Click the globe. Click the globe and you can do it. Love that. Boom! Clutch. Huber is... Look at that. Look at that. It's good. That's a cool map. Shows you the whole area. I dig it. Take all of her stuff. <laughs> Robber. Yeah. <laughs> she went right back to sleep. Yeah, it's like back to bed. See ya. Don't mind me. Oh, what does sleeping get you? Hi. Uh, earlier it said it advances night to day. It's like if you don't like the nighttime, just sleep. Oh. Okay. So maybe there's just like something extra at night. I don't know. Yeah, there any like yeah, or it's not special. like health or stamina. Or yeah, like any kind of like material that's only available at night, possibly. Huh? Um, it says you can go that way, but it's blocked off. See the sign? Was make it dark grow. That's Ooh. end game. Right yeah, there. Uh, that's the end shit. game. <laughs> it's a dungeon in there. <laughs> Yeah, back to the thicket. How are you liking the sounds? The good sound design? Good sounds. The nature sounds? Alright. Really good noises. Thicket. To the uh -oh, thicket. People are dropping bear puns in the chat. Excellent. Keep them up. <laughs> that is a thicket. Ooh. Clear the way. Yo. Jolly. Shortcuts. Back to your home, yeah, souls, let's go. We need a <laughs> souls. <laughs> Breakfast souls. <Yeah. laughs> We're looking for a book, spelling book. Yeah. Who would have spelling? I was down here. Okay. Oh, to the Black Moss. Black Moss. Sketch. Sketch. Sketchy, dude, I got no clue. Dark Root Basin down there, okay. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Wait, there's an eye up there. Have you looked at that? There's a grave? Yeah. Oh, dang. Dark. <gasps> Pop looking film. Whoa. Forest god right there. Yeah. Yo, I wonder if the book is in our house. Maybe. Book on spell. Who's that? Our mom. Oh. Hook us up. Yo. Get paid. Does this give you some free money? Or allowance? How much did you get? 100, it looks like. Nice. Six. Weekly allowance. Did okay. you look at that one? Yeah. What is denim? Look on spelling. If 
find this thing. Denim, another Gabby fact. It's called denim because it's from, I believe, a place in France called Nîmes. So, de Nîmes. That is a weird one. Of Nîmes? <laughs> That's a weird fact. That's a good weird fact. Is that real or is that just... That's real. All right. All right, we're heading back. Look at that. Quests are getting knocked out. I remember hearing the story of the creation of the potato chip. I don't know, I'm pretty sure it's not true, but it was a fun story. Someone told me when I was a kid. Go on. It was like, was it, it was like France or, I want to say France. It was either France or you, somewhere in the UK, what you missed those are worthless. Oh, oh. oh. Uh, those where it was on like a train. It was on a train, and the chef was preparing the food for everyone, and someone like wanted, like what was it, like a, a sandwich or something, or the bread or whatever, and or so, something like that. Like they wanted their food, and they kept saying it wasn't cooked enough. It wasn't cooked enough, and the chef was taking it as an insult. So he like just like took it was something with a potato so it must have been like something else not like a sandwich or something and like just like fried it on purpose like burnt ah. it to a crisp like because you're so pissed and, really and tossed it like just had to <laughs> them bring it out to them and the person complaining like took it in spades it's like Shh, whatever i'll try it and like ate it and apparently said you know that's this is pretty good actually you make me more or something dude what do yeah. we just built Whoa! Visiting Dude, center. look at that. That's sick. Information kiosk. Dude, you have a future now. Look at this. It's like better than your freaking bed yeah. and breakfast. <laughs> what? Yeah, right? It really is. <laughs> Pay it forward, Tony. Yeah. So anyway, even though I got a lot of details, like, even wrong from that, like, like hearsay story, it was like, apparently an angry customer angering a chef led Read them to them. do something drastic. And then the customer's like, actually, this is pretty good. Yeah. And thus, potato chip. But I think it's not true because I remember years ago googling that and it's like <laughs> oh like urban myths or whatever that aren't true. <clears throat> I was like ah that stinks. So let's I'm actually gonna look it up right now again. Yeah. It's like origin of the potato chip. Origin of the potato Whoa, chip there. in Ireland. So it was Ireland. Ah. The potato chip was invented in 1853 by George Crum. That's Crum was a Native American, African American chef at the Moon Lake Lodge Resort in Saratoga Springs, New York, USA. Okay. French fries were popular at the restaurant and one day a diner complained that the fries were too thick. Okay. So it's a little offshoot of yeah. this. Okay. So it's an offshoot. I heard it was Europe. You said it was 18 what? Uh, so a potato chip is, blah, 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 blah. let's see the origin. Okay, the history. The earliest known recipe for something similar to today's potato chips is in William Kitchen Kitchener's The Book, The Cook's Oracle, published in 1817, which was a bestseller in the United Kingdom and the U.S. The 1822's edition recipe for potatoes fried in slices or shavings reads, Peel large potatoes, cut them in shavings round and round, as you would peel a lemon, dry them in a well, dry them well in a clean cloth, and fry them in lard or dripping. An 1825 British book about French cookery calls them palm. Oh, you. Where? Palm de terre frites. I don't see the. Oh yeah, palm de terre frites. Second recipe. <laughs> it calls for. It means apple of the earth, fried apple of the earth. Gotcha. Yeah. Calls for thin slices of potatoes fried in clarified butter or goose dripping drained and sprinkled with salt okay these are early okay here we go a legend this is a, this is a okay. legend a legend <laughs> associates the creation of potato chips with saratoga springs new york decades later than the first recorded recipe by the late 19th century a popular version of the story attributed the dish to george crumb a cook at moon's lake house who was trying to appease an unhappy customer on august 24th 1853. 18, okay this is in new york and so immediately or pre-civil war the customer kept sending back his french fried potatoes complaining they were too thick too soggy or not salted enough. Huh. Frustrated, Crumb sliced several potatoes extremely thin, fried them to a crisp, and seasoned them with extra salt. To surprise, the customer loved them. They soon came to be called Saratoga Chips, a name that persisted into the mid-20th century. Huh. A version of this story was popularized in 1973, 
national advertising campaign by St. Regis Paper Company, which manufactured packaging for chips, claiming that Crumb's customer was Cornelius Vanderbilt. <laughs> Crumb <Okay>. was also <laughs> a renowned <laughs> chef at the time, and he owned a lakeside restaurant by 1860, which he called Crumb's House. The Saratoga Chips brand name still exists today. So apparently, the, yeah, this legend, this is probably true, but elsewhere in the world there were recipes yeah, in similar. Europe for... In, in other parts of the U.S. and in the U.K., so he's about 30 years off, from 30 to 40 yeah. years off, yeah. That's cool. Nomenclature. <laughs> I love this. Little consistency exists in the English-speaking word for the name of this food. North American English uses chips, though Canadians may also call French fries, especially thick, thick ones, chips as well. Crisp may be used for the thin fried slices made from potato paste. An example of this type of snack is Pringles, which chooses to market their pro product as potato crisp, even in the United States. In the United Kingdom and Ireland, crisp are potato chips, which are eaten at room temperature, whilst chips are similar to french fries, as in fish and chips, and are served hot. In Australia, some parts and uh, sorry, in Australia, some parts of South Africa, New Zealand, India, and the West Indies, especially in Barbados, both forms of potato product are simply known as chips, as are the larger homestyle variety. In the north of New Zealand, they are sometimes affectionately known as chippies. However, they are marketed as chips throughout the country. In our, in Australia, New Zealand, a distinction is sometimes made between hot chips, fried potatoes and chips or potato chips. Ah. In Bangladesh, they are generally known as chip or chips and much less frequently as crisp, pronounced crisp. Ah. And locally, uh, alubaja, the, uh, for their similarity to the fried potato dish, uh, baji, I don't know if I pronounced that right. Um, in German speaking countries, I need Isla here, Austria, Germany, uh, Tuffle chips, chips, tuffle right chips, in. often shortened to chips, Switzerland, um, palm, palm chips. chips, and in countries of the former Yugoslavia, fried thin potato slices are known as chips, uh, locally pronounced very similar to the English pronunciation. With a clear distinction from french fries, in Brazil, homestyle potato chips are known as batatas portuguesas, or Portuguese potatoes, if their sides are relatively smooth, and batatas uh, prussianas, uh, Prussian potatoes, if their sides show a wafer biscuit-like pattern, oh. <laughs> whilst American-like industrial uniform potato chips made from a fried potato puree-based dough, oh geez, are known as batata chips, potato chips, or just chips. Wow. Holy crap. <laughs> the history of chips. There you go. <laughs> Love Thank chips. you, Wikipedia. Love oh chips. man, health concerns. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, everything in moderation. Chip? Everything in moderation, yeah. everything. Life, everything. What's your oh man, chip? we gotta go back to tier maker of chips. I got a lot of favorite chips. It, it's all, it all changes. Like, like Depending all my rules, like my whole life, everything is just constantly fluctuating. Some of my favorite <laughs> ones always been like the, uh, the, 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 the <gasps> Lay's barbecue. Oh, so Straight up Lay's barbecue. Ruffle. Cool Ranch. Cool Ranch. That's Doritos. Yeah. Yeah. Are we talking about. about potato chips? Yeah, just chips. Just chips. Oh, any kind chip. of chips. Sorry, Even a corn Pringles, chip. chips oh, and salsa. There we go. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, here the, we go. The Tostitos with lime. Tostitos All with lime. All right, so we did this already. Um, Dude, there's a new <laughs> We, we, we did this. Remember the, remember the tear maker chat? All right, so. But he were, nor I were there for that. Takis. Oh, we should bring that up. Oh, I want to show those you Those are this. dank. I like those. Dude, Takis are so good. The fault flavor, this stuff is great. Like um, the vajita flavor ones are really good. Guacamole ones are a little bit lower than the default in that because they're a little inconsistent sometimes. Um, the flaming hot barbecue ruffles. I love flaming hot Cheetos and mm. jalapeno Cheetos. The, the jalapeno Cheetos, mm. God, those are the best. Jalapeno Cheetos are good. Um, My roommate makes a great. You know what elote is? Oh yeah. She makes a great elote where she like crushes up flaming hot Cheetos. Oh, yeah. it's so good. Michelada is my favorite drink ever. It's got some like of the best the tahini mm. on there. Oh yeah, tahini. some of the uh, what is the, the good best Doritos? Uh, Mexican Doritos, the uh, Diablo flavored. Ooh, sure, yeah. Here, here. Maybe too hot. Flamas, oh, no, actually not hot. 
uh, I mean, they're, they're spicy, but, like, they're not, like, hotter than any oh. of the thing. It's just, like, a different type of, like, powder on it that's different from any, like, the, like, f flaming hot nacho Doritos or even, like, Flamas. By the way, Flamas are the best Doritos. <laughs> Don't at me. These ones, dude. Hot ones? Oh, yeah, hot Those ones. Those are good. Yeah. They're fucking so spicy. But they're incredible. But their potatoes are potato crisp. Remember, they're <laughs> yeah. so good. They're so good. The hot, hot ones, are... Pringles. What is the like type of? That one's hot. a verde. It's like a gr salsa green verde. One they have. Is okay. a good Dorito. It's insane. They are s Chet. I love spicy food. I can handle a lot of spice, and these Pringles Oof, will you. make you buckle, dude. You <laughs> like? Wait, do you still have some? I still have some, yeah. Can you bring them in? Buckle. I, I'll get like a new, fresh okay, okay. one. I have oh. like, there's oh. like five left. I, I'm not at the very end of the first <laughs> can, I'm but they're like the first night. Cause you know when you eat spicy food, sometimes you just like keep doing it, like oh it'll be fine, it'll yeah, be fine. Yeah, and then later you're like, I regret. Dude, I had like ten of them, and I was I was like, holy shit! <laughs> I was like, this is crazy. Oh. I had to get like cranberry juice. I was like, dude, because <laughs> if something is insanely spicy for me, like I'm I'm at the level where it's like, holy fuck, this is spicy. It's not like ah, yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. I'm not like dying. It's just like, yo, this is intense. Yeah. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Holy shit. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. I can't eat these today. I have to wait till Saturday. Dude. But they're back in stock for I love shrimp chips. But the hot garlic oh, Calbee shrimp oh, chips. Oh, shit. Yeah. Love shrimp chips. They have been out of stock for like a long time and they finally got them back in they stock. They have, they're, how are they shrimp? They're just shrimp. Like, flavored? Flavored, yeah. Look like that. Peppers and garlic, hot garlic. Mm. Calbee shrimp chips, the original Japanese crunchy shrimp snack for more than 50 years, has become an American favorite too. Made from wild caught sea shrimps, this deliciously baked snack captures authentic flavors including hot garlic, yuzu, and black pepper, <laughs> wasabi, in the classic original. Enjoy sharing this delightfully crunchy treat with your family and friends. Bonds. 60 grams shrimp of shrimp carbs bonds. in this bag. Whoa. 60 gram, grams of carbs? Yeah, for that holy bag. Shit. That is a lot of carbs in that bag. Holy yeah, hell. Holy Too shit. many carbs. Holy hell. No, it's three servings. Yeah, times 19. Oh, I see. Which I, see. I rounded up, yeah. Dang. Yeah, 10 grams of carbs. Or, South or of Timber Crossing. Or less, this day. South of Timber Crossing. Which is ironically that for if you're on a normal diet, uh, times three, that's only one. Four, this bag only has one fourth the total carbs you should be eating each day. Kale can times diet. three. Kale can times ten. No, I told him never to do it that high. Go go no. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Kale can rules, dude. I like it more than Super Saiyan. Is that weird? Kaioken, literally, <laughs> so World bad. King Fist, or Fist of the King of the World, Shit is a technique invented by King Kai. However, Goku is the only person ever to use it successfully. It is a technique Hell that yeah. multiplies the user's key for a heartbeat, thus increasing their power and speed and enabling them to inflict serious damage to, to opponents who are considerably stronger than them. However, the downside of the Kaioken is that it takes a heavy toll on the user's body, yeah. making them more vulnerable to enemy attacks. Yeah, Jirobi, dude, had to watch While him. in the state, the user's aura color becomes crimson. The technique requires the use of key control to handle it properly. Go away. Sick. Not bad. When activating the Kaioken, the user gains a red and fiery aura, and in turn, their whole body and clothes acquire a reddish tint. The power of the aura also bristles the user's hair and clothes if they have any. Unlike other transformations like the Super Saiyan or Golden Frieza, the Kaioken must remain with its aura active all the time. There is no change to the user's physique, but the enormous stress of the technique can result in increased blood pressure, popping out veins and swelling the user's muscles mass. 
The technique can also generate large amounts of heat from the user's body while it's being activated, creating steam rising from their bodies. Hey. As a result of the Kaioken, the user's base power level, strength, speed, and even sensory awareness greatly increase for an instant. With training, the length of activation can be increased, as shown during Goku's extended use of the technique against Frieza. Eventually, during the fight with Hit, Goku manages to hold a casual conversation with the technique active and uses it continuously during their next engagement. This change is quantified as doubling the user's power level for the base Kaioken technique. Okay. Dope. Love it, Damiani. Kaioken lore. Shit rules. Can you have Kaioken and Super Saiyan active at the same time? Super Kaioken. A24, is that a nod? Super King World Fist is a combination of the Super Saiyan transformation and the Kaioken technique. In both variants of the form, the user <laughs> unleashes a crimson Kaioken oh aura and around themselves. Oh for, for Goku, the aura is combined with his standard Super Saiyan aura, and his body and hair gain an intense red hue. So for right. Zeno Vegito, he retains his- Zeno Vegito, dude! <laughs> what is this Dragon Ball GT shit? That's what it sounds like. Uh, I think it is a Xenoverse. It's... Okay. Oh my god. Yo, where's Jadis oh, in the chat? Oh, I, I know where it's from, never mind. The Scavengers, dude, Walking Dead, The Dark Times. <laughs> Worst storyline ever. <laughs> dude, people live in a fucking trash dump. It's so bad. Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken. Kaioken can be used alongside the Super Saiyan Blue form, with the anime showing the multiplier going up to times 20. Nice, so Super Saiyan. Super Saiyan 4 Kaioken. In some video games, the Super Saiyan 4 Form has been combined with Kaioken as a power up. Wait, are the mouse tiny? Are the mice tiny? This one is, yeah. Wait, where? I don't it's right see. there, you see? Oh, and where's that one? I don't even know. <laughs> Every Kaioken ever, 38 minutes. That's the best. That is the uh, best. I wish like, we could watch that. Damn it. <laughs> That is so good. <laughs> Kaioken times a thousand. Kaioken! The new Kaioken! Goku. This new Goku goes Kaioken times a thousand. <laughs> Goku's the best. Okay, if Goku was able to use Kaioken times a thousand to one million at base, <laughs> at base form, even Super Saiyan form, would he gain Wait. sufficient energy required to destroy? Oh, oh. <laughs> you write that, that get that wood. Don't need it. Oh, oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Don't need it. I appreciate. I appreciate the call out though. <laughs> Keeping us honest, Gabby. Well, I don't, what do you Ooh. need? Or At this point, just we're just carry? doing random quests. Yeah, we don't even need to build anything right now. Okay. But you can't carry it like for later. We can, but it just takes time, and you know, <laughs> need. I mean, we could pick up every single uh, thing if we wanted to. I see, I see here. <laughs> trying to keep it moving. Trying to keep these quests knocking. Get it. Get it. I like, I like this. Charlotte. Yeah, That's a good humor to rant about uh, treatment of uh, ser food service people. Yeah, what about it? Uh, fire DoorDash driver confronts customer who said her Chipotle was never delivered. Okay. So I did read this already. So yeah, what, what happened? happened was a woman ordered Chipotle. On DoorDash. On DoorDash. Okay. Um, at her office. And the dude- So actually, like a work lunch break? Dude actually did deliver it. Okay. But then she reported it not delivered, so she get the money back. She was trying to like get a free lunch. Dude! And then he got terminated. His contract got terminated. So he was able, because they will tell you what job you were like got in trouble for. He went back there and told like, basically there's a video of him confronting her. And I didn't watch the video, but everyone's like comments like, oh, he's not like angry or anything. He's just like telling her like, you basically lied and got my, you caused me to lose my job. Yeah. 
So it's like, just want you to know, like, you're a piece of shit for doing that, basically. Mm. Like, how would you feel if you lost your job or something? That is hard. That was the crux of it. But apparently, in the comments, someone, like, who worked there was like, oh, yeah, she did get fired because a manager witnessed the thing and went around and, like, talked to other employees and, like, ver verified that she did do this. And yeah. it's, it's like, she caused a scene at work mm. that, like, was of her doing. It was, like, her Unprofessional. fault. Unprofessional. And she was apparently only two weeks into the job, like, in training oh. status. So, like, they're like, hey, whatever, you're not worth it, bye. Oh, shit. That is crazy. But, uh, but also raises questions about, like, you know, DoorDash, like, you know, not treating their drivers like people and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. you're or, just a number. You're just a number. People dude. not realizing that people delivering their food and stuff are human beings. And, oh, like, yeah. yeah. Nobody yeah. gives they a shit. They realize, they just don't care. Yeah. yeah. Dude, once food is on the line, people are irrational. <laughs> just talk to Iowa about going to the Alamo Draft House. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> We're going on Sunday. See nope. Nope. Once food is once food I, is in. I, I I said this already, but like you know Amazon Prime gives you like Grubhub Plus or whatever benefits, so you get like the free delivery. It's just seeing all the added tacked on cost, even on top, like without that. I don't understand how people, like, individual people just, like, don't always go out and buy their food. I'm like, what? How can you, like, pay this much money, like, for each meal for delivery? I'm like, what? I don't understand. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't do, it's I don't so do expensive. ever since Especially COVID, now. I don't do any Grubhub food hub. Oh, I I will drive yeah. myself yeah. to I, get I, the I food and bring it back. Yeah. That is it. Trust no one. Fox more. Well, yeah, I was about to say, it's, <laughs> it's partly like I don't want to pay the fright, like, the, yeah. like, don't, I don't want to be lazy and have to pay extra for it. Like, yeah. It's like, okay, 15, like, 15 to 20 minutes out of the uh, the home, like, whoop de doo Like, I need to get out for a bit. Two, exactly. it's if you want to make out. sure your thing is right, it's like, do it yourself. Like, yeah. like you know, the person who's, like, picking up multiple orders and stuff, you, like, is it really their fault if they can't get everything right? Like, Sometimes it's not even their fault. Like it's a restaurant that just forgot to give them something. So it's yeah. like, at least I do. I will say though, whether it's a result of all the delivery services or it's also a part to COVID, so people don't like don't open bags or whatever when you get there. Yeah. I don't like the sticker thing sealing things mm. because they're they're doing it for I think for like the delivery services yeah. to help ensure that they're not open and tampered with. Yeah, yeah. But as an individual, it's like no, I want to check my order, and make sure it's right, and like. The worst offender is Panda Express because they Love like they Panda twist Express. they twist it up and then they wrap this super super sticky sticker all around it. So like I literally just like have to tear the bag open and like look inside. I'm yeah. like it, I'm never opening. Like how I, I'm never even gonna open this. And I, like I feel bad. I'm, but I'm like I gotta check. Like you know yeah. I don't want to go home. And, like it's better now when I'm here. Yeah. So I can just be like hey I'm sorry you forgot this like or whatever. Because if you drive home and come back it's like. Hey, are you really gonna drive and come back? And like, it usually causes more of an issue because like, yeah. you t like especially if a manager over here is like you left and came back, you're like, oh no no no, like yeah. let me make this right. And then like the employee is probably gonna get talked to. It's like no, like they don't need to be talked to. Like please don't do that. After that newest uh, Better Call Saul chat, don't say anything. I'm don't say going. Anything. To, I'm craving a restaurant. That's very. That's it. That's okay. all. I'm don't craving. Say anything. Wait, I want to know. It. That's it. I'm just, I, I need, I'm going gonna go to a place that was like, dude, that's where I get all my cravings from. That's why I started drinking Modelo, Better Call Saul, <laughs> a couple seasons ago, man. I was like, man, they make that shit look good. I want a Modelo. Wait, I want to know what restaurant. I mean, it's not a spoiler at all. Can you? It goes back to season, Cinnabon. It goes back to oh. season one. Oh, yeah. okay. I need Fine. Cinnabon. I need a Cinnabon. Like, I need it so bad in my life. I want a Cinnabon so badly. Sounds delicious. I haven't had one of those in years. That's Brad's number one. What? Cinnabon. Brad really? does not like my, sweets. My brother likes he's, it. He's lot. super not into sweets, dude. Cinnabon is like, it's like, oh my god, oh my god. I don't, I don't like kid. Cinnabon. We're kids. Like at the mall, he always wanted a Cinnabon. Your yeah. brother? Yeah. That's sick. Shush, child. And they're good. It's just. Crave them then yeah. really much. <laughs> like cinnamon rolls are like to me like they have to be like the like fresh and like kind of like warm or hot. Like 
pre the chemically pre prepackaged pre yeah like. prepackaged ones are so disgusting yeah no i can't no, eat no, a prepackaged no. one no, no 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 i had one or two and i was like these are so bad Uh, I try to eat healthy. I, I usually have, uh, right now. you know, life's a struggle. So I usually have like two to three healthy dinners a week, which I think is ahead of probably the majority of a lot of you. Yeah. <laughs> so like, fit. it's true, dude. People eat like fucking trash, dude. It's not a, it's, uh, I'm not calling anyone out. It's like true, dude. We all eat shit every night. It is. That's... <laughs> Southwestern salad and a there's, cup of chili for dinner last night. Yeah, there's no call out. It's just facts. <laughs> Dude, we all eat garbage. That's, that's salad. <laughs> I have I have salad at least five times a week, Huber. Nice. I love salad. Yes, love yesterday salad. I had for lunch I had Zenko chicken uh, salad bowl with chicken tartar. Is Zenko chicken the one where the family that guy like murdered everyone? Is that Zanku Chicken? No, I don't know anything about that. <laughs> All I know is apparently the episode of Curb Your Enthusiasm where they go to like a Mediterranean chicken place, it's supposedly based on that place. That's why I ever tried it in the first place is because I saw it on Curb. I'm like, what's this restaurant? It looks yes, really good. Yes, Zanku Chicken Murders. Oh dear. <laughs> well, I just go and pick up my food from there and it's like very well lit in a very crowded like shopping center. So yeah. Wait, so, so people got murdered there, or, or someone involved in the company did something? Is someone involved in the company? When and is it like... In 2003, after a heated argument, oh. Zanku chicken owner Mardiros Iskandarian shot and killed his sister, Zovig Mar Marjik, and his mother, Marguerite Iskandarian. He then killed himself. Okay. Crazy. It's fucked up. Really fucked but up. But no longer alive and no longer profiting and okay. Yeah. Sorry, I thought this was a recent development. I'm like, please tell me. No, 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 no. It no. was like, I, wait, like right when it. I can't lose sound. another place that no, I need no. to eat at. <laughs> but yeah, they at uh, uh, beginning of this year they added uh, bowls and salads. They used to not do those. Oh. So yeah, I get their salad with no pita chips, and I don't like goat cheese, so I don't get the cheese or the pita chips, and double portion of chicken tarna. The garlic sauce. Yeah, I get is their like, garlic. Oh my god. It Fuck, garlic's so yeah, hard. garlic's fine, but like I use uh, so I I don't like tahini that much, and mm. uh, unfortunately, and even their lemon tahini like just wasn't doing like working for me, so I just go to the grocery store and buy a Greek dressing, ah. and uh, you like dress it yourself. Yeah, I just do the dressing myself, and then you know, I mean, sec. dip some of the garlic or dip oh, some Jesus. of the chicken chunks, the big chunks of tarna. That like that's too like I'll just eat that itself and like dip it into like the garlic and it's like mmm. So just a bunch of veggies and protein and and garlic and mm. it's a, like a Greek vinaigrette so it's like a thin no cream like gotta stay away from creamy dressings because they use cream and sugar and those. Ah uh, yeah. But like vinaigrettes are very fun, are just perfect. Balsamics are good too. I I love my favorite salad to like make at home is just spinach mm -hmm. and some kind of protein and then I like make a dressing with just like olive oil and vinegar and a little bit of honey and like just uh, some like spice. I love uh, uh, olive oil and vinegar is like oh, sometimes <laughs> it's enough for me. Yes, like, like at an Italian oh. restaurant, like olive oil and vinegar. Yeah, oh man, now chat's getting some good ones. Um, <laughs> yeah. I don't. I, I mean, no. I mean, tahini is actually not bad. Like, it's not. I, if I like tahini, I would like. I would eat it. it it's actually just like garlic is not mm. the garlic stuff they make there. The mashed garlic, it's not bad for you. That that's how I'm talking. I'm talking about like Caesar dressings and like. Actually, blue cheese is not bad calorie wise. Sure, if you're looking at like calorie counting calories, but if you're looking at like no, carbs, carbs, it's yeah. a cheese dressing. So like it actually is the, the most keto friendly dressing. Yeah, yeah. But it's the dressing I hate the most. It's <laughs> like eh, not really. So I gotta stick to like like vinaigrettes and uh, yeah, ginger dress. The, anything oh, with ginger. I love Love, love ginger, ginger so much. So good. Ginger no, I love sweetie. cheese. I love cheese. I just don't like blue cheese chat. Not a fan of blue cheese yeah. and goat. Sorry, goat cheese, blue cheese, but I like like provolone, so you Swiss, don't like soft cheese. Yeah, like yeah, exactly. Oh, okay. I like Gouda, um, uh, Colby Jack, uh, Pepper Jack, um, Brie, uh, 
Gee, I could, we go on for days, but anything that's like a harder cheese, mozzarella is like the softest cheese that I like, and I do like. I'll just eat a ball of mozzarella. Oh. Like grocery stores they sell like a tiny oh, yeah, like yeah, little ones, little... a tiny one. I'll just like <laughs> do that. It's great. Love mozzarella. <laughs> yeah. Easy cheese isn't cheese. <laughs> yeah. I, so, so to me, American cheese is not a cheese. It's literally not cheese. And I hate it. I hate it on everything I, I ever have. I, 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 and that's why In N Out, it's the one, like, I like In N Out's burgers, but their cheese sucks. I hate that cheese. Is it like American? It's American. Cheese? It's just a slice of American cheese. I would give anything from the news, like cheddar, cheddar cheese instead, or like any other cheese. That's why, I like, places like Jack or Wendy's, Jack in a Box or Wendy's, yeah. they use. The, any other place uses different cheeses except for like, you know, but it's also the one I want to go to because like they're the best tasting. Anyway, really? Well, like In-N-Out the best of the current fast food burgers. And by fast food, they have a drive-through. Okay. Um, because any place that's a sit down, I'll call it fast food, but it's a different category fast of fast casual. food. So yeah, like <laughs> like Five Guys is fast mm -hmm. casual, but like Shake Shack and Shake Shack, those blow away any yeah, of the yeah, drive-through yeah. burgers. So not even the thing. But the thing I found out, sorry. Tangentially related, but still fast food. <laughs> uh, Jersey Mike's does bowls. I found this out a few months ago. Because I, I, I had the, the one of the hardest things to give up two years ago was like sandwiches. I'm like, those are one of my go to things. I'm like, too much bread, man. That's like one of the biggest offenders. And uh, I was like, how? And I, I thought I just had to give them up. And like, I wasn't eating sandwiches forever. And I was like, man, I'm kind of sad. <laughs> And then, like, I found out one day I went in there for my cheat meal, and I'm like, wait, you guys do bowls? What do they look like? So I went home and, like, went to their menu and looked at, like, their site and looked at, like, oh, wow. Well, you know what? I don't, I tried two. I tried the Italian and a tuna mm -hmm. as a bowl. Mm -hmm. Tuna was fantastic. The Italian was okay, but, uh -huh. like, it does, they, how they chop it up, it doesn't really go as well. But, like, tuna fish bowl there is, like, freaking great so it's Damn. like and they do it like they do it still the mic styles like the onions olive uh, sorry the olive oil and vinegar um the oregano and stuff so it's like everything on there just no bread and i'm like yes i love this this is great for me so <laughs> um but back to burgers yeah like um shake shack uh Ugh. man so good except one time uh they had a they had a Korean inspired mm -hmm. special like chicken and burger section mm -hmm. and all of it was super disappointing. Oh, that's <laughs> I should have known. That I was sucks. like, yeah, I shouldn't be going to Shake Shack for these. I was like, so expensive Shake the Shack? The yeah, they are very expensive, so but they good. are they are good. That's yeah, so the good. Korean stuff was very underwhelming. I was very it was a waste of a cheat day that day. I was like, gosh darn it. I Although I am definitely gonna try to go to Kane's on Saturday. <laughs> No, once a month, because there's one in Burbank now. I don't have to go so far. I'm once a month excursion to the Canes, but this is like the last weekend to do it, so I want to go. It's also the end of when they're enforcing a bunch of restrictions where it is because too long didn't read. The thing got delayed by almost a year because neighborhood people did not did everything in their power to prevent it from getting uh, opened. Okay. Um, but they finally opened with a compromise. and But for the first six weeks of its opening, they have a bunch of street closures and crap. It's, and they also are not doing a, a, a order aheads or parking in their parking lot oh. because the the line goes down a major street for. Uh, one, it, it was a forty five minute wait when I went, yeah. um, and that was like, yeah. But I think the twenty seventh is the last day they're enforcing that. So if I can do order ahead, that will be great. Because by the time I drive over there, the wait will probably be like done for like an order ahead. So I can just pull into the, the order ahead spots and just get it and leave. Charlie? Yeah. So hungry now? I, I know. know, I'm sorry. I, I have a gigantic bowl of ramen that I brought <laughs> that I forgot about. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Shit! It's a good thing. That sounds have. so good. Yeah, it's it's naked ramen from Tatsu. Oh, I love Tatsu. Naked, naked ramen. In like, it just doesn't have broth. Yeah. That's oh, good. so it would be the opposite of what I would get. Tatsu's good. So. I haven't, Tatsu's I, vegetarian friendly. I haven't had Tatsu yeah. in a while. I, I have mine with um, pork belly. So it's not, it's not vegetarian. Can but we not talk about this? I'm, I'm, so, I'm sorry. legit so hungry. So, I'm sorry. Let's not talk about yep. food anymore. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, it's gonna weird you out. Really? It's make you unhungry. <laughs> Are you gonna get food after this? Definitely. Okay. <laughs> Are you on the podcast? Yeah, but we got like three yeah. minutes in between. Do you want to order right now so it's here? Oh, uh, I, I usually just get uh, some fried wontons. Okay. It takes like 10 minutes. Okay. Nice. 
little snack. But, uh, I Somebody CC'd me that, Alex. Was it you? Sester's no, 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 no. Soapbox? I hope he's talking about Last of Us. Uh, bean Sprouts is a substitute. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, so if you're looking for a keto friendly ramen, Bean Sprouts. <laughs> Stop substitute. Talking about food. It's like there's no way Huber's getting hungry from hearing Bean Sprouts. I love Bean Sprouts. Okay, never mind. I love them too, but like, this is the thing that makes you like. Stop. I, crave, I crave food now. Bean <laughs> Sprouts, man. Yeah. I love food. I love all food. Mm. Liverwurst. I'm so hungry. I don't know if I had the liver waste. Okay, I'm trying to think of stuff that you bought. I'll try now. everything once though. <laughs> Is this over at. We have time? one more hour. We have another hour. I'll be right. Although we can technically end early and Hubert can go get his food. No, and come I back mean, and I'm eat. all right. Are you I'm okay? All right. I'm 100% all right. I promise. You got some ramen? I mean, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> you know what, you know what, don't the, worry what, about what, me. What's the okay, game okay. we're playing right now called? Baron Breakfast. Dude, sausage and egg McMuffin. Mmm, that sounds good. <laughs> I mean, Chad, we're, not talking about food. we're not talking anymore. It's just Huber doing it itself. Um, if anyone talks about, about food in chat, time them out. Are you talking about McDonald's version or just in general? Stop. McDonald's. Oh, <laughs> it tastes good, but man, their stuff, their breakfast stuff is greasy. And like, while it tastes the great, my, greasy. my stomach pays for it. Um, Definitely. Sorry, you're getting, like, you want, I'm trying to gross them out. Um, when I get like McDonald's, like so, like bread, if I'm actually open up out. for breakfast, it's very hard. I don't, I can't eat the bread, so I just take the sausage McMuffin, like egg McMuffin, or whatever. I take off the sourdough or the egg, English muffin part, and just eat the everything else because I can eat everything. I can eat the egg, the cheese, and the in the sausage. I just can't eat the the bread, the breaded part. Hmm. So yeah, like the okay. the biscuit or the English muffin, I can't, yeah. eat, I can't eat, I can't Shit. eat that. So yeah. <laughs> So it's like holding a greasy piece of like sausage in my hand. Just trying to, <laughs> trying to go some out. <laughs> yeah, grease, grease doesn't really. Uh, yeah. I forgot the, uh, how much. Because it's worked. like what you expect. Yeah. You know, when you eat at a McDonald's, like you're 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 signing up for the grease. The best, <laughs> the, the best thing that they don't really have anymore was freaking a uh, steak, egg, and cheese bagel. Some places in the U.S. still have it, but we don't have it here. Though apparently it's not as good as it used to be, so I don't feel too bad that we lost it. Egg whites. Uh, uh, Ban anyone who talks about food. Starbucks had something with egg whites. A Tommy Ami's ban. Yeah. <laughs> okay, joking. No, uh, the, uh, I don't know, not the, uh, the egg bites they have at uh, I love those. Yeah, they have a they have an egg white version. Like one of the three ones is an egg white. Yeah, those are really good, but they're too expensive. I haven't gone to Starbucks forever. You can get them at stores though. Yes. Yeah. Especially since I found out I can't drink coffee because it destroys my digestive system. Cleaning up. Cleaning up. I like how this place has gotten bigger and bigger, Huber. It's yeah. like it's like you have a town here soon. I, I see know. the makings of a town. We gotta go check on our guest. Should be. Like, you have a guest? Yeah. <laughs> we got one guest in that little shoebox of a bedroom. Now, you're bringing all these humans here. Are they gonna displace you and your friends though? Eventually, like, is this like game of that's really the gentrification game. the that's game? That's the end game, yeah. Yeah, yeah, all the humans. But like, it's like, but like, it's also a metaphor for like humans deforestation, though. Like, it's kind of like, up. yeah, like. It's like Tom Poco. Oh yeah, it's like this is the OG version. <laughs> it was like nature, peace out. You are kind of cleaning up. Yeah. Dude, is that eighty miles per hour? Or just Route eighty. Route eighty. Yeah. Okay, I was like, dude. Yeah. Well, it sorry, it is Europe, so it's kilometers. Because okay, they spell so tire like with a Y in this game. Yeah. So it could be 80 kilometers. Is that the English smelling? Tire yeah. with a Y? Yeah. It's yeah. interesting. That's how they knew what game we were playing on Tuesday was uh, uh, the second, the first game. Power Wash Simulator. Power Wash Simulator. Nice, nice, nice. Or sorry, uh, Stream Team. They're like, wash the tires. That's yeah. Dude, Earl Grey tea is pretty good, but like any kind of green tea. Speaking of, where, where's my green tea right now? Do you drink matcha? Oh, I drink matcha. That's that's my go-to. That's the best. Oh, oh motel. Sick. So we can build that up. But right now I'm drinking jasmine. Oh, oh my god, that's huge. <laughs> well, it's because we have no drinks yeah, right know. now, so, so we're here the whole day. I need a whole pretty much like drink a lot. I do drink a lot of. Have you been playing the whole time? Yeah. 
maybe Gabby wants to play. No, 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 no. Oh, I was like... <laughs> I, that was not was meant that to code be. For that was not meant Gabby to Gabby wants to play? <laughs> uh, passive aggressive. Would you I was like just curious. I was just curious. Would you like to play? Oh, he already went... If he, if he, if he, we only have an hour, but it's like... Power Wash Simulator, by the way. <laughs> Is it on here? Well, we can boot it up? Oh, it's on the Xbox. But I think it's on our Xbox, yeah. Dude, it's you want. We should do it. Do you want soothing? Yeah, we should do it. Oh man, after how stressful he's been about this we game. We should do it. This game stresses level. me the fuck out. Yeah, we can stop. We can yeah. stop. Do you want to try it? Save up and Cut. let me know, and like I can boot it up for you. This game stresses oh, me I out. I want to soothe you. I want you to be soothed. Yeah, if you don't like it. I like it. It's just. Oh, I need the. Whenever you're done, I need the. the, the, the not the keyboard. I, I like. Set up the screen. I like so this I game. Something. Crafting freaks me out, but also like. This type of game, like, this is one of my... I don't like doing this, okay? Just, like, legit just picking up trash. That's all we're doing. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're you know, a video game cuts garbage man. Loading, so trash collector. Yeah. It's why I don't traditionally play management games, because you're just, like... Wandering picking up, around. You're picking up garbage, wandering around, flooding your inventory with yeah. shit. Like, I I downloaded. Oh my god, what is that game called? Very famous, like farming simulator. Stardew Valley. Stardew Valley. Stardew Valley. So yeah, I yeah. I downloaded Stardew Valley. I was yeah. like, this is so cute. I'm gonna have so much fun. But yeah. then when I realized you like ad actually had to do work and you couldn't just yeah. talk to everyone, I was really upset and I deleted the game. <laughs> it was a mission for Nintendo Online members for Platinum Coins to play it once. <laughs> so I played it and I was like, same thing, I like, I left the intro, I'm like, uh, nah. I was so mad, I was so mad, I couldn't just talk to everyone. Oh, sorry, did you save? Hold on. Cool, let me grab these. I think that game, it's really good if you like that kind of game. Yeah. Really, really good. I, it's very streamlined chat. For how bad I am at that stuff, like the quest design was really solid. It was intuitive. It felt, I never felt like stuck, stuck. The characters are really cute. Yeah. The art style is really cute. Maybe a little too much story? <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm hearing this from people. I mean, I agree. I'm yeah, what do you like, mean? Person who's like a champion of I know of, source, like, of lore, but it's lore. just like it's, like, it's wow. over the years. Over the years, every single game has become narrative driven. It feels like, and it's like not every game needs that. It's the difference between like lore for lore's sake and meaningful lore. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. It just felt and like. They take so long to say something that can be said in one sentence. Like, yo, you need to build this for the guests. And they just like talk in riddles and circles to say yeah, like, build like, this for the guests. I only got one life. Game. Yeah. Riddle me this. I'd still recommend it though, if you're into that stuff. Like if you like Stardew and Don't Starve and survival crafting sim management things, that's a good one. Sleeping Dogs. I played it on my own a few years ago, so I'm good. Looks good. Sure. Remind me later. <laughs> yes. How do you... Oh, we were playing on Bloodworth. Okay, mm. sorry. Let me switch uh, users. So. Switch. Shit. He's in the other room. Assassin, real quick. Yeah. Yeah. We were progressing on your profile. I wish that all the time, Ken. I always wish that we talk about it on our group streams, like every once in a while. And we're not we're full screen. Yeah, so. I don't know if, uh, if the level that's half done will still be half done or, sure. or what, but you probably pick a different mark. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's just like right in the middle of it. So you could keep going on this level, or you could go back to a different level. Mode. 
Oh, yeah, I guess this is the only. Oh, wait. No, that's Clean the player. This is new. All right. This so, is, yeah. The dirt bike might be a little easier one. It's like yeah, a 75 bucks. Good, good, sure. Good thing to break you in, humor. Let's here do it. Go. This should be soothing. Some I'm very excited bike. to see your reaction to this. <laughs> Yeah, that's all the story you're getting. That's Excellent. it. That's, that's all it. You it's need. a little bit of a setup, and you maybe get some text Bear messages. Bear in the breakfast would have been like when I rode my dirt bike three <laughs> years ago. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's like, oh my God. I will we'll coach you through the instructions. You don't have to read that. We'll okay. tell you how to fire everything. That's actually way more controls than I thought there would be. It's really easy. I, I didn't use like any of them. Oh, God, okay. So. Come on, Blood Earth. Maniac. You know, right? Yep. Sick. Yeah. Sick in the head. Yep. Maniac. Those options, yeah. Like. That one right there. Invert right stick. That's it. And then you're good. Like, we're, we're controlling a power wash. It's okay. We're not flying a jet. A jet, I know. Come on, it's blood. Uh, deranged. I don't know. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Alright, so play like a, <laughs> try playing like FPS, like, like, like Call of Duty. I just like teasing Blood and Jones about it. <laughs> yeah, try playing like Call of Duty. Try like the other stuff. It's like prone, you can go prone and stuff with the R. So right trigger has, you have three levels, two levels of prone. You can go down two more. RB, LB cycles through your uh, nozzles. So like different weapons. Left trigger uh, tilts. So if you wanna like make that go vertical. And then if you, uh, yeah. And then I believe it's a left on the D-pad We'll just keep it auto firing. Left on the D pad. And then right on the D pad will show you uh, the dirt. To highlight it in like orange or pink. It might be up on the D pad's auto fire, sorry. Oh, one, one changes it to like n no Manual. motion sick. Mo yeah, like people like me. Even though this game actually is pretty slow, I didn't need it. Yeah, that's it. That's all there is to it, Huber. Amazing. Just enjoy. And uh, whatever you hit, Huber, in the top left, it shows like a meter. And uh, the white, you want to eliminate it, get rid of all the white. Uh, so all the like, glowing yeah. shit? Yeah, so it's sh the part you're hitting, it'll show you your progress. Oh, and then it, the 81 is the overall progress. So, like, oh, it's yeah. really easy to figure out what you're missing. Yeah, and right D pad will highlight. Yeah, see the dirt? Yeah. All up in You there. can like tap it. If you keep tapping it, I was doing that to cheese a bit to keep yeah. it. But like. Yeah, but visually you can just see dirt marks too. There it is. Get that tire. Yeah. Get in there. Yeah, front's pretty dirty. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, that's all there is to this game. Yeah, yeah, you can go even further prone if you want to get lower. Yeah. Get up in there. It has all thanks to Jones. Jones is highly recommending this game. He's put a casual 50 hours into it. Has he really? Yeah. So uh, I guess for him it must be a nine or higher. Ha ha ha. Hey, Jones is probably at a hundred hours now. You're right, Chad. All right, Chad. I'm about to read a message from Blood about the near thing. But uh. Yeah, where are we at with this near secret? Is this all just like viral marketing for next near game chat? You think it's a it's a troll? I feel like because the game is on PC, you could data mine this and like hack to see this easily. I don't get it. Like when there's a PC version of a game, you could see everything. So like, what what is this? What is this? To do list. To be pressed up. It means you're close to being done. Got it. 
So, target. <laughs> yeah. There's the button that shows you what's still dirty. So, like, the engine, Hubert, when you're hitting it, yeah, yeah. like, slow down. Like, when you hit something in the top left, nice. watch to see if it has any white left. And then, like, what you're hitting, if it does, you can, like, spam the right D pad to see what highlights. There you go. Now the front fender is the last thing. Oh yeah, it's probably inside of it. Yeah. Get lower. Oh yeah. yeah. There you go. There Boom. Seven hundred bucks. Bank it. Look at that. That is expensive. To Yo, just dude. Just spray your dirt dude, bike. Dude, this is a like personal job so for water. like a nice bike. Let's trash the place before we go. You can't. Disrespect your surroundings. Yeah. Nice job, Huber. And it time lapses. Well, it's us. What was that? Hazmat suit, dude. House of Ashes. <laughs> yep. Dude, playground. Let's go. Resume it. <laughs> Goaty right here. Yo, is this fully out or early so Yeah, this is that released on Tuesday. Nice. Sorry, last week. Tuesday last week. PC, Xbox? Uh, yeah, it's Xbox and PC only, I believe, at the moment. Game Pass, though, I believe. Isn't it relaxing? Fuck yeah. yeah it's what I always say about Euro Truck Simulator. It's one of the greatest games ever made. I want, I would. And it's like exactly like the premise of this, where you're like. Doesn't sound. Oh, yeah, wait, stop for a second, Huber. Go super engaging. Walk. Like all you're doing is just like driving from point A to point B, but it's like the most relaxing. Ten out of ten. Stop spraying for a second. Uh, go up the the slide. Oh yeah. <laughs> go up here and go to the edge of the slide and look down. Look down in the middle. You gotta go a little towards the side. Can you read that? Heart. I can't read that. Gabby? Gab <laughs> I forgot I did that. Yeah, I can't, can't barely even read that. It's hard. It's hard <laughs> to control the, I like the, the heart. jet. Thanks. <laughs> We're going to clean the slide up. Sorry, chat. I wanted to see if Gabby's yeah, signature is still there. <laughs> Hell yeah. Poor Huber. Straight in. Power away. washes it yeah. away. <laughs> I feel like a really good podcast would be like a talk show while you play a truck simulator. Hell yeah. Like long haul. Who was the one showing me the video? Me. You, me. Dude, 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 yeah, Huber. The there guy's you go. setup. Yeah, oh, we where it's like a truck. Yeah, yeah I've seen we need that. that setup for podcasts. Yeah, we'll we put just, it in the in We the just trash beat two room. people in there, like, yeah, we just have two people in there, like, pretending they're on the road. Just talking about stuff. What do you use the money for in this game? Buy upgraded equipment. Nice. And tools. That's the premise. You're, you're like, you did your first job, and you have like an agent who's basically hooking you up with uh, more jobs based on like people like, oh, you did a good job for this one. Like, we'll hire you now for this other one. Though we think some of the jobs are a little low paying at first. <laughs> uh, yeah, they are. Like, what was it like? Five hundred dollars or something? Yeah, four or five hundred dollars to clean a whole backyard. I was like, Jeez, what? Are you crazy? Discount. Seriously. Friends and family. Yeah, especially. Plus one. Yeah. Seven percent clean. What is up with this slide, dude? <laughs> oh, maybe it's no, like the whole structure. No, seven cents overall. The the bar when you shoot something right now, see how it says like vertical. Yeah. That white bar. Look, at this slide. Look how insane this thing is. So you have like ten percent left. There's ten percent somewhere. Yes, yeah, so oh, there. Right here, right here. Yeah. See, that's like yeah, that's like platform. So if you go back to slide, it all. Just so, yeah. It's probably up on the bottom. House Flipper was fun too. Same kind of shit. Remember when that took off? 
show. Power Wash Simulator before Power Wash Simulator. Uh, oh. House Flipper. Is it House Flipper? Is it called? Oh, that was fun. Oh, yeah, show. Yeah, that's the show, right? What's that's the game? Yeah, it's the game. House Flipper. That okay. was so fun. That was, what, two years ago, probably? <gasps> Steve can make tic-tac-toe. Can you move those? Oh. Oh. Mark it down. Bullshit. Mark it down. Missed opportunity for a mini game. You can also turn the nozzle. I actually almost feel like you're playing a firefighting game without hitting the fire. This one is dirty. There's a lot. Yeah. This one's crazy. And it's funny, the the, the, the synopsis for this one yeah. is some, like, was it, park uh, administrator saying, oh, we got some complaints that some children got sick of my thing, but, like, obviously that's wrong and stuff. <laughs> like, the place is, like, in great condition, so... But just to, like, be careful, can you come by and clean it just to, like, appease the parents? Then you come look at this thing, it's like, yeah, bud. Dude, sure. there's a ladder? Yeah, dude. Look at this that. is fucking sick. What? I would love this job in real life. Just put some headphones in and clean a playground. off his ladder. <laughs> Workers calm. Seriously. Do my grandma fall off the ladder? Oh, back no. in the day, yeah, like busted her ankle, never fully healed. <gasps> yeah. Oh, that's so scary. Yeah. It's a good looking roof. <laughs> that reflections. You know, it's ray tracing? Mm hmm. It's Xbox, man. Xbox Series X. We had someone in chat complaining that the reflections look better on the X than the S. They were like, oh, my S didn't look this good. That's right. Power of ray tracing. S doesn't, <laughs> S doesn't have ray tracing. <laughs> it's very true, you should never use the ladder by yourself. a good safety tip. Oh god. Oh. That. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that would be sick if you yeah. climb the pole. <gasps> Dude, one of the bonus houses is the Ghostbuster firehouse. You have to clean it. Wait, really? No. Oh, like, oh, 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 oh. Oh my god, dude. This game would rule if it had crossovers. Yeah, yeah. dude. Clean RPD. I was just about to say clean this information. After, yeah. yeah, after, like, yeah, it's like somehow after the, the outbreak of the, the one where they never fired the nuke. So good. So it's like you got to go through as part of, like, Umbrella to, like, clean up. Like, corp company called Umbrella is a really big job for you. <laughs> it seems so a little awesome. weird, but the pay is too good to ignore. You down to take it? No, yeah, Spencer State Mansion. There you go. That's what Gabby said. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. I just wanted to do the Spencer Mansion in VR already. Like, let me just look at it. Like in the, oh, you mean just walk around? Yeah. I'm surprised no one's done that like as a PC thing, like custom. I'm sure there's a mod. There's a modding community is not mess around. Yeah, clean Hyrule Castle would be one. The white, the white nozzle is pretty weak. Yeah. Speedrun strats. Oh, yeah. <laughs> any, any place in The Last of Us to clean anywhere? Everywhere? Yeah, everywhere. Everywhere. <laughs> the school. The school? Ghost Town. The one underground? Oh. Oh. Wait. The high school? And the boomer comes in the gym. Yeah. What am I thinking of the one that had like kids were taking classes underground, like in a sewer? Oh, that's uh, Desh's place. The boat. But that's in the sewer in one? with Sam and Henry. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. That's one. Yeah. Hell yeah. 
What about a Batman game? Arkham? You gotta clean up. <laughs> clean up Arkham would be so fun. This is... This is quite a task here we got. This is no joke. Yeah. So they pay the big bucks. Yeah. Try it. Is it soothing here? It is so okay. soothing. Time, time. I'm soothed. Huh? I am so soothed. Turn it again. Unlimited water, it's nice. <laughs> Filling in those little holes, that's what I love. Those little spots. Yeah. And then when it blinks, when you get that blue, like, <laughs> oh, it feels so good. Like I accomplished yeah. something. I like spray it too much. Because mm -hmm. I can't leave even a speck. <laughs> I want Don to see too. Don's here. Is he? Don. You want me to get him? Never know when Don's uh, here. Uh, that's Don works. Is he? Mm -hmm. I mean, Maybe, I don't know. Don, Don works hard. Cool. Harder than it looks. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It really is. <laughs> I was not expecting. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Especially when there's like one percent left of something and you yeah. can't find the glowing. It's really. You plan on packing? No. I no, didn't. So good. Soothing. Yeah. But emotional. Emotionally soothing. <laughs> and devastating. All right, Huber. Yo. We're going to have to go on and watch this trailer. Don't say anything. Oh, did you guys bail on Baron Breakfast? Yeah, we bailed. It was too stressful for Huber. No, it's just too stressful, man. I gave Huber a less stressful game. It's honestly work. So you have to use the, um, the, like, jet one to get that We'll see. You'll, like, sit here. Which one, the yellow? It's, like, really grimy. Oh, let me grab my phone. Yeah. Oh, the red, yeah. The red. I'll get it queued up to be done. I hope I didn't see this. I'm going to tell you how. I'm going to check right now where my... How far into it I was. No, no, no. no, 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 no don't, don't, don't look. Don't look. No, no, no. Don't just stop. Uh, I was at 3651. I didn't watch the last four you minutes of this. Okay, good. I didn't watch the last four. How uh, fate would it? Is this something? What could Anna Perna oh, possibly get? Oh, wow, this is a. Uh... Oh, the dirt still. The whole park. Yeah, you're on like the laser. Pointer well, like, oh. this this dirt's like really tough to get off. Oh, is it? Yeah. Let me get, Let me get these little spots, and then we're good. These couple spots here. Couple last little spots. Last little spots. Last little spots. Last little spots. See so you in an hour, chat. Art. Yeah. You have, you have to. Yeah. It's too caked on. You need uh. a strong jet for this little one. Nice. All right. All right. So we got a whole cam here. We'll get it. We'll get it. We'll get it. Right. Wait, we have to switch the TV. Yeah. Hit all four, enter. What's up? 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 What's up with the whack PlayStation? Sup? What's up? What's up? What's up? All right, you ready, Don? Ready. Oh, Hit me. Gosh. No headphones or anything. We're just gonna go with this. I'm gonna mute my mic though. Blast Hit it. Me. Hit me. There we go. Blast it. Good. Good. That looks like a licensed dinosaur. It looked like a licensed dinosaur. Oh, we're really in this. We're in this world, aren't we? 
Look at this. Good. Good. Oh. This is crazy. What was that? Oh my gosh. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Holy shit. <gasps> Turf four. Described as a survival horror game. That's not VR though. Huh? It, uh, no. it gives me totally. It gives me strong the forest vibes. Yeah. Yeah. What was that? There was some Dino game that was VR that never came out, and it looked it was that one shot when they're hiding under the log, looking up. It almost mm. looked identical. For a second, I thought that was the game finally coming out. Well, I loved it. Shit. I don't know what game you're talking about. This shot ray. No VR though. Later on. Later on. Yeah, yeah. Someday. <laughs> I'll just pick this something to be disappointed. Well, if you're in, gonna be in first person, stuck here, you want to. It like be looks so amazing. Yeah, that shot. That's the shot I'm talking about. <laughs> but I can't that have looked, it. So what was this other game eyes. now? Because yeah. this almost looks identical to the game they showed off. Like wow, it was a couple years ago. I look at that. This like, is nice. That, like, dome, That's really cool. The like, broken the dome. Yeah, oh, That's yeah, like the, the aviary, aviary. That, and it's all broken. You can see. You're those, totally right. They all escaped. Oh, it looks like the whole place is old. Old and run down Chris? though, because look at that satellite's uh, all busted up. Go back a couple of frames, Demi. Pause oh, that on Mario the Kart again. Eight trailer. See, is actually Japanese. Yeah. That looks like Japanese in the corner. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I was gonna go to is the there Japanese corner. on the whiteboard? Yeah, it's gonna stop here. I like the lights go out. Oh. It's all math. Well, there's no, it's English. English. Federal Bureau of Control. <laughs> Shit yeah. <laughs> Dilation Quantum coefficient, receiver. collider, collider lambda section. Quantum receiver. Deep. I like the sounds of that. Oh my. Hydraulic beams! Quantum do you ever think we'll that get... might be time travel? Water hate... lasers, Huber. I hate to always bring it up, but do you think we'll ever get Just a like... game where you don't know what it is until like you beat it or you're so yeah, I'm thinking of PT. Oh. The the Norman Reedus reveal. You know? <laughs> He didn't, so like like that. He, didn't like that <laughs> he didn't like that. He didn't like that. Any logo on there? Oh. It's like you finish this game and all of a sudden you're like, oh, I was playing as Dr. Grant. Yeah, what's <laughs> so, you know what I mean? I, just, oh, I mean, that would be sick. I D E H A M A is like a company name. Idahama. 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 Yeah. That's like Masrani. Idahama? Idahama? Masrani Corp. <laughs> yeah. Caution oh, yeah. restricted area. They're not showing us the big what they have though. They have something bigger than these guys. Yeah, these like are carnage. small time, oh, right? Yeah. These are the medium size for sure. Yeah. These are the easy allies of dinosaurs here. <laughs> uh, medium fries. Medium fry. Oh, uh, oh. Approved personnel. What are all equipment. Must be must warned. Must be warned, yeah. Now, Don, I gotta know why would you light the flare right here? For the trailer. That's the thing that's <laughs> odd. It looked like they were about to engage each other, right? I mean, the dinosaurs were about to engage these carnivores. Because they needed the, because it's the wrong thing to do. It'll attract the dinosaur and make it kill you for the trailer. That's coming in for a slice. Yeah. <laughs> Look at those claws. This? Look at that. I don't know why you'd like the flare, though. That's a very good question. That was a good shot. I mean, I know I, I would like that flare, but I don't know why a normal person would like a flare. <laughs> in freeze! Here, here. I love how in the new <laughs> Dominion, when he did it at the end, it was like this whole mystical. They played like, like dun, 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 yes. and he was like he all like. His lesson. I just saw something I did not expect. He was doing some like dance before a volcano, like a right, sacrifice. Just to like, watch this. So next tight. Thing. Hang on. Bloodworth coming in with some Look breaking at this news. Email. Blood's got an Blood's email. Blood's got something. From yeah. Annapurna people. Okay. Look at this section's title. I haven't been this excited about <laughs> Mario Kart in years. <laughs> we made it! <laughs> we made it! There's a there's a section of the Annapurna's official press release email 
Shadow drops. Entitled Shadow Drops. Hell yeah. Oh my god! I don't know. <laughs> That's a great idea. <laughs> <laughs> if they put DLC, uh, Canis says Power Bosh the Dinosaurs. If they put Dino D uh, DLC and Power Bosh, <laughs> that would actually be fun. Right. Imagine washing off like a Brontosaurus. Was there a dinosaur on the playground? Yeah, I think yeah, there so. is. Yeah, there's yeah, there's yeah, there's 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 on the playground, playground, dude. You can watch it. Oh, yeah. Wash the stegosaurus. Yeah. But it's not a. I would it's love not a to, real. Oh, I would love yeah, it to we be do a need muddy to see this for the and just walking underneath. <laughs> that sounds so fun, Don. Oh, where's the. This, I oh, I haven't seen this yet. I haven't been this excited about Mario Kart in a long time. This is a good batch of levels here. Wait, this is, very good. Oh, this is only wave two? Yeah. Wave two out of six. But the others are coming Holy before the end of the year, so they're going to come pretty fast. Sky High Sunday is a brand new. Yeah, this is brand new. New course. So wait, by the time this game's over, there's gonna be a yeah, hundred courses or what? <laughs> six more? Trash. There's Eight six more. expansion six packs. Six waves. That's crazy. With each? Yeah. Whoa. That's 48 alone. Yeah, it's gonna be like 100. It's nuts. Wow. Yeah. Here we go. I was worried it might look too similar to the Here other. Like, Yo. There we go. There we go. The Can absolute. you go? Oh, oh, this oh, this oh, they're all good. Yes. They're all good. Yes. Yes. Such a good batch of levels. Oh, yeah, okay. we need oh, 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 we'll cut to that one. Oh, yeah, I, I like that, that one. one. Yeah, yeah. Two or Sydney, I don't know about that. Yeah, these I don't That's know about. The, the tour New York one looks really cool, though. I, I haven't played it, but it looks neat. Oh, all right. They go to real places. Watch, it show you New York. In tour, yeah. The tour ones were a little short, but they weren't too bad. This looks oh, good. Yeah. Usually I don't like pinball video wow. game stuff, and this level looks sick as hell. This looks really good. Love pinball video what a good game. level. <laughs> what a excellent. good level. Look at this, watch. It gets level. better, too. Jay, there's one shot with the pinball just creeping about to smash you. Not that right here. Right, see it coming? Dude, are you afraid uh, of the dark, the pinball wizard episode? Oh. When it's like coming down the escalator? <laughs> I don't remember that. I barely remember. Good trapped course. in the mall. Good course. Nice. Look at that. The big ball going around? Oh, wow. And the course is like nah. ramps, it looked like. Did you see the actual I don't ramp? know the GBA like ones. Yeah, I don't know this one. Whoa. This, this one looks neat. Oh, that park looks cute. It looks neat, right? Yeah. Is this? that like your homeland? Yeah, it looks exactly is like this. Is this New York? <laughs> oh, the UN! <laughs> Does that happen in New York? You got, you got giant turtle monsters you running around ghosts, on motorcycles? Uh, you got booze. Yeah. I do like the look of the it. The little mini. Or Empire I guess that's State what the UN that's 30 so rocks. It looks like New Dog City. Wow. And this is the other thing I like. Watch this. Wave two. I love that they're calling these waves. What's wave it's seven? Exactly. Wave race. What is wave seven? That's what I want to know. I'm feeling good about Nintendo right now. Wait, there is no wave seven. Exactly. He's saying wave seven is wave race. Yeah. <laughs> Why would they choose That's wave? a really fair price for 48 courses. Holy shit. But you know what it's it is? It's just to get pass. people to right. commit get to be online through the year. You know that they're going to have all these It's to get people like. on that expansion pack. Yeah. And they're, that's yeah, why Don, they're parsing them out. Good part, good thing for chat. That's right, what are you, how are you feeling about the possibility of one of those courses coming up in the future waves being a wave race steam track? Oh, you one of the new courses? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. I think wave race se wave it's seven coming. is going to be wave race. So wave race I'm is really coming. Like it would be now. weird because they'd 100%. have to like put a track around like a wave race. Like they don't have any kind of boat <laughs> mechanics. <laughs> yeah. That'll be oh, that's Mario Kart Nine. I bet boats. Mario Boat. Wait, they did submarines Diddy Kong and shit. Race. Oh, yeah, yeah, I mean, a water yeah. Mario Kart would be pretty well, they, bad. There's levels Diddy where you Kong go race. underwater yeah. and stuff like that. But Maybe entirely underwater. I don't, I don't think, think where you really go on the surface. You can't, like, ride on waves. Right, right. I, that's going to be a nine. Wave seven. Can't wait. Can't wave. Very nice. Well, thank you. What time is it? Oh, Clean the dino. That was uh, an absolute thrill. Oh, could I? Yeah. Are we at Dino? Don? Don, this is one of the it's... most soothing games we wanted you. This is what you missed on uh... the stream team. So we have the opportunity now. No, there it is. Over. Oh, okay. So it's not better. huge. Oh, it's a dino slide. Yeah. Let me to investigate what this. Now, what happened at this playground? That's what yeah, I want to know. Yeah, what happened here? Something. This somehow, stuff is pristine. How is this pristine? Something yeah. dropped out of the sky. Some yeah. kind of disaster of epic proportions went down. All right. Okay, I need something yeah. wider though. Bumper, bumper. Yep. The yellow is uh, the best one. Is that it? Yellow is a good balance of power and spray. Too far away, Don. Uh, 
I don't want to get mist all over myself. I mean, I'm gonna ruin my, <laughs> ruin my clothes. You're a power wash professional. You're wearing a hazmat suit. Yeah, you you're can... not afraid of any. Yeah, you're actually wearing a full you're... hazmat yeah, suit. Yeah, yeah. Don't, no worries. Oh. About your is this attire. powerful enough on this grind? This is going so slow. Yeah. You can pump it up. Pump it How up. Do one. Do it? How do you... Well, that's the red. Watching this game doesn't oh. make it seem too soothing. To me. It's not soothing so far. I'm stressed like crazy because yeah. it's not washing fast enough. The pressure of having to clean all this shit off of this? There's no time limit. Wash fast. The, there's no rush. All the time in the world. There's no rush. Time. Like, life is the time. I'm running limit. out of time here. You're gonna oh. die. Ah. Oh. It's okay. Your wife is at home. Looking back on my I'm life. I'm watching this Stegosaurus. I'd, I'll be like, Stegosaurus. no regrets, Pine Power Wash Simulator. That was time well spent. Really? Yeah. Time well spent here. Uh, Don hates it. It's okay. Don's always the opposite of whatever you think he's gonna think. Yeah. Well, if I had a much perhaps on purpose stronger jet, like a fire hose. I mean, this is this is stronger than a fire hose. You just gotta is be this? closer. I don't want to get the. Uh, this is gonna like, take a finger off. My... <laughs> Zer. Can I see myself? Is this... It's looking awesome, dude, Barney. Can you ever clean it too much and like damage? Maybe I need to go though? slower. I love it. But you you can also spots. hit um, right on the D-pad, and it'll show you what where the dirt is. Grime vision. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> grime vision. <laughs> That's excellent. Carpet is grime. Rick grime. How am I gonna get underneath the dinosaur? So you can go squat. with a right trigger in three, two levels of proneness. Yeah, you can go lower. Wow. Here we go. Here Get up we in go. That belly. John's coming around now. This is what I... <laughs> <laughs> He's not worried about getting water on himself now. Life oh. found a way, Chad. <laughs> Life found a way. There we go. You can also turn the nozzle by hitting... Dude, like, Gotham trigger. DLC would be Trigger's so blood. sick. Oh. Clean up Gotham. Oh, for this game. Yeah. I can't... I'm you, s you end up like solving crimes. <laughs> you play the cleanup crew and John Wick. Yeah, I love those guys. What's his name? Hey, John. Hey, so oh, and so. What was that? Oh, that's the cop. That's right, that's right. Yeah, it goes, you working? Yeah. yeah. You working? Everything all right? Yeah. So. All right, take it easy. All I need is for Common to come back in part four. It's all I want. Who? Common. Common. I, I saw want part four to be the you last one. There's already like five too. and six and a spinoff confirmed. It's not Jeez. happening. Yeah. I saw Common at the juice bar near my house. Oh. Yeah. Common seems cool. No doubt. Common seems he awesome. He was really... I didn't talk to him, but he was like... Just seemed... Chill and normal. I loved smoking aces when it came out. Why do my eyes hurt so bad? Smoking aces. I need some drops. I need some drops. I don't think I ever saw that. Really? I don't think so. I love smoking aces. Top 10, like. I can't remember that at all. Top 10 anime premises. Yeah. Like, all the world's assassins come to a casino in Vegas to kill someone. So you have all these different, like, <laughs> factions. That sounds fun. That's amazing. That's Smoking Aces is? Yeah. yeah. Okay, and they're all fuck, Dude, Alicia Keys is the fucking goat in that movie. She rules. Oh, my God. One of my favorite characters ever, oh, dude. Alicia one. Keys and Smoking Aces. Oh. I feel like I've... I thought I'd seen that, but Keys? I don't remember it. Someone came out forever ago, but it's, like, never been on any streaming services. Smoking Aces? Yeah. Yeah, I've been meaning to rewatch it. I, I bet it doesn't hold up. As well as I remember, but at the time it was awesome. What's Either that? Your thoughts on Assassins with Antonio Banderas and Sylvester Stallone? Yeah, yeah, I like it. Okay, you like it? I haven't it? seen it in oh, like I need to see that fifteen too. years. Yeah, I don't think I don't know if I ever saw that one. It's been a long time. My neighbor had that one, the VHS Damiani. You yeah, used to come on like TNT or TV oh, no, all the time. Nice. And like just like. The waiting part of it, like Antonio Banderas out in the sun waiting yeah. for like the. And, oh, yeah. it's, that's the meme, right? Is the the yeah, Antonio that's Banderas? That's it. Yeah, that's yeah. where it comes from. Because yep. he finally gets the contract for Wait, Sylvester Stallone. So the yep. whole game, yep. the, sorry, the whole movie, 
He's being like Sylvester Stallone's like one step ahead of him on jobs, and he's losing out jobs so and he gets really annoyed. He goes, "Oh, people keep saying you're the best and stuff, and like I'm gonna show you." And then finally, they put a hit on Sylvester Stallone, and they send it to Antonio Banderas, and he just looks at the screen when he gets it, and he's just like, Whoa. he's so happy. Uh, <laughs> so good. Someone said they think it's on HBO Max. Smoking, this is nice. I know they had a sequel that was straight to DVD. Yeah. With like Vinnie Jones, maybe. What about what about Seven Psychopaths, Hubert? Dude, love Seven Psychopaths. What about what? Eight Heads in a Duffel Bag? Haven't seen it in a while, but I love Joe Pesci. Nine to you. You gotta come up with a nine movie. Yo, Seven Psychopaths is a ten. Nine and a half. Well, I, I was, I was, I was nine late. and a half weeks something? Oh, yes. Nine, nine the whole nine yards. We gotta okay. find Seven our way all the way to 28 Days Later. We have to find our Empire way. nod in the very beginning. Um, I, I've always wanted I was to right edit about together. The, the guys getting um, on work done, Hoho can be Oh, uh, cool. Like, people saying each day of the year into a video, like January 1st There's a movie December called Christmas. Nine, but... Because it must, Stop like, every movie. date yeah, must I've be... Oh, yeah, yeah, Nine. It was just called Nine. Yeah. Movie. In, in, there are two in, Like, I wanted to edit together clips from every movie, like... Every... Oh, that's a good that's, one, that's a good one, that's a good one. Know, Gabby, I love that idea. Well, Thank somebody you. did that with time of day. There's a thing, I think it's called 24 Hours oh, or something like that. There. But they found footage of oh every, every minute every minute and every of the whole clock from movies here we go here and we go, strung go. them together into a 24-hour clock that is awesome. insane and it was like an art exhibit that was showing no. you could just like no. go in at any time and I'm it would be sick. that time, time yeah and, and nick of time with, oh yeah uh, nick of johnny nick depp of time. i've seen that and walking dude real Chris time walk real time 90 minutes bonaventure hotel dude nick is of time the is time they ever sick that? Do you know what a Pomodoro mm -hmm. oh, is? Like the only time did that in the film. Um, Real time? Like, yeah, for the entire movie. Like, schedule No, whatever? absolutely not. So it's, a, Real -time it's like movies a system done. where you, you work for yeah. 25 uh. minutes, and then you have a break for five minutes, and you work uh. for 25, break for five. And Marissa and I want to make a Spirited Away Pomodoro, where after the five minutes is up and you have to step over, uh, go back to work, uh, you Why hear Kamaji say, back to work, you lazy sootballs. <laughs> High noon, bro. <laughs> 10 out of 10, one of the best of all time. Gary Cooper, dude, High let's noon. go. Does that count as 12? Western Faith. God, I love it. I think I told you already, we watched Quick Grace and the Dead. Grace Kelly, dude, Princess Quick, Grace. Quick in the Dead? Quick in the Dead? Dude. Hell yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I like Power Watch Simulator. <laughs> Don't like it at all, but if I can get this off, Don doesn't like I it. Don't. Oh, I you, thought this was gonna be so harder, satisfying. Use the harder. Uh, like, look, at the, look at the here giant we go, here we go, here playground. We go, here we go, here we go. Run, Lola, run. Ah. That's the classic real-time movie. Impossible. Oh, this yeah, game's impossible. <laughs> run, Lola, run. Hi. Run, Lola, run. Like you have to clean this whole goddamn all right, it's all right, playground. Dog. Thank you. Yeah. The dinosaur trailer. Thank you for That's the dinosaur. That's so much. Well, you don't have to do anything. It's gonna take you four hours to clean it. That's the point. That's the you just point. like sit there and you just, like, yeah, it's yeah. meditative. It's so meditative. Yeah. My goodness. It's really good to stream something like this because you can talk to chat. Like chat, you know when I'm playing freaking Rogue Legacy too. Like <laughs> I talk to you once, like when I'm in town, and then see you in thirty minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wait. Oh, every missed piece just makes me crazy. <laughs> I know. Same. Well, I, I, I like to play for a little bit. Yeah, you want to play Arla? Uh -huh. Oh. You want to play? I can give it a shot. <laughs> oh, me? Little oh, old me? me? Little old little me? Little old you. <gasps> This game is popular with a lot of streamers, but yeah, and VTubers, yes. Hell yeah, it is. It's really good streaming. It's game. more satisfying when you're the one doing it. Yeah. Yes. Yes. It I is. mean, I still think. Watching this was making me crazy because, like, you don't—they don't go where you want them to go and do what you want them to clean. Yeah. It's a. That's it's like the a plot test. You can figure out people's personalities. Yeah, I'm the a very controlling they, person. The way that people play this game. <laughs> you gotta free yourself. Um, See, I'm the kind of person, I, I'm going to go in a grid system and not move forward until an area is finished, you know? And then when you hit the right D-pad button, you'll see how much you'd still missed. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. Not a fucking drop, Damiani. Are you Look sure? at that. Are you, are you sure? <laughs> in the area I was doing, there's nothing. Mm -hmm. Yes, everywhere I've done, there's nothing so far. 
I see an outline right there. I'm seeing some darks. Yeah, Nothing's it's, there, it's on the side. No, no, no. I didn't get to that yet. Tell me, I've only done it's the okay. slide. Okay. <laughs> Everything I've done is perfect! Zombies can't, zombies can't grab you on the slide. <laughs> you can't get grabbed on the slide. I should be cutting the series mods over there. Do you need to go do that? You can wash this slide. Now I have to finish the slide. Take a load off. Wash this thing. I'm relaxing my eyes. Yeah, yeah that's kind of how you gotta do it. I cleaned a whole, almost the whole backyard yesterday. Oh, I can't see that tweet. The desk chat. What tweet? Someone sent a tweet in chat, but no one says the desk. We don't care about your tweets, chat. JK, oh. we do. I could literally fall asleep to this. Same. It's so relaxing. The sound of water, too. Is yeah. What the hell's going on here in Power Watch Simulator? You Physical might limitations because um, you're still a person, so it won't let you move. Where your body would hit against something technically. No, I just was wondering oh. why it wasn't cleaning that part. Oh, not enough pressure. Damiani, I bet you fifty dollars that I can clean the interior of this slide and nothing will show up on the the detective vision on the interior. You realize this is a video game, not real life, so. <laughs> While well, your thoroughness would like work in real life, video game programming, there might be some cheese. Some bad hit detection or something. You have the mercy of the coders. He won't, he won't take that he won't take it. He's afraid. Right. He He's knows a, I'm a clean queen. Involves money. It's afraid. It's afraid Oh, what is that? That's so familiar. That's from uh I'm from Buenos Aires! And I say Kill them all! <laughs> Oh, aliens. <laughs> yep, aliens. Yep, <laughs> nailed it. Nailed it. It's not. What yeah. is it? Aliens, Star troopers. troopers. Oh. <laughs> it's time, dude. It's time for a Starship Troopers comeback. They're... The world is ready, dude. The world is so the ready. Is... You know that Starship <laughs> Troopers why, RTS? Why are they, why is the world ready? Where you ready? were like, yo, it looks like shit? Yeah. Dude, it reviewed well. Okay. Yeah. And because it's time, dude, ask chat. Straw poll. <laughs> Do you want a Starship Troopers revival? Be yes honest. or no? Be honest, Yes Jack. or no? Don't feel pressured to say yeah, yes. Yeah, don't feel pressure. You can say no, but I just think the majority of us want it. <laughs> there was the animated series that no one watched. Roughnecks, dude. Roughnecks was so good. <laughs> Hashtag leave it dead. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! <All right. laughs> Uh, yeah, it's got to be very satirical. Like, like the not at all. Sorry, sure. Huber. Huber, I feel like you get the same response that you did to Pacific Rim Uprising. <laughs> Whatever, dude. You and Don. You, you and Don. You and Don. Stand alone with that. Yeah. What, Gabby? Just seeing if you're enjoying it. I, it's, at your face. it's conflicting. It's odd because I'm enjoying it, but I can feel my life slipping away. You know, like I'm, I'm not, I can't, I can't just let my life pass me as I'm power washing things. You know, like I wouldn't play this on my own time, but like streaming it is great. Starship Troopers by Matt Reeves. Exactly. <laughs> yes, please. Mike Flanagan. Starship Troopers. <laughs> It'd be so weird. His wife would play every character. <laughs> Rico's rough necks. What's good about this Isla is as soon as you clean this thing you're gonna say, well, you never need to play that again. Yeah. You know? <laughs> you fully... You are getting it out of your system right here. You are getting yeah. the power wash experience. I imagine if I was like, because they say when you're feeling like you're gonna have a panic attack or like feel really anxious, you should do stuff with your fine motor skills. Yeah. I feel like this would be such a good game to play if you're Straight like up. feeling really 
anxious. Yeah. It's funny. It makes me feel more anxious. I like it because it's, and it's one of the reasons I love video games, it's because you're getting something done. Yeah. Even if that thing is like superficial and doesn't really matter, it's like my brain knows that it's like finishing a task yeah. and it feels good. All the icons on the map are gone. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I achieved something. Yeah. Sorry, Uber61 wow. uh, chat voted no. Whoa. Okay. Okay. Chad, That's surprising, Chad actually. Chad hates you as a person, Uber. That's surprising. Uh, has the 39% not seen Starship Troopers? I mean, it was in the 90s. A lot of you might not have been born. I mean, yeah. What do you think, Don? Is the world ready for another Starship Troopers? Long overdue. S Straw Thanks, poll, Don. Who Long was overdue. who has seen Starship Troopers? Thanks, Don. Appreciate it, man. Does anybody want these little rice ball things that I'm going to pick up for me blood? Food, food, food. I'm starving, Where are you dude. Going? You want any little rice ball things? Check out the thing. Yeah? Yeah, dude. Yes. <laughs> I might be interested. Yes. I can no. take over while What's the restaurant right? called? Oh. I gotta finish this interior of the Stegosaurus. Oh, mm -hmm. I hate it, Don! I thought the water would be one more effective. He was almost <laughs> not doing it right. <laughs> he was doing it fine. What are you talking about? He was like uh, all over the place. He's like, it's not working. <laughs> He's using the weakest one. You know Dung. He tried something for one second. He's like, I don't understand it. Yeah. He also intentionally sabotages it. Yeah. Like new. Ooh. Oh wait, Isla. What? Go up to the top of the slide. That slide? Yeah. Hang on. I need to prove to Damiani that I've got what it takes. <sighs> Damiani doesn't believe that I've got the stuff. The stuff? what it takes to be a power washer. Yeah, you do. Well, you might get bored of it before you finish. 77% of chat has seen Starship Troopers. Okay. And 39% did not want another one. So really, it's only like 9% of the people who have seen it. Right, it's 39% okay. of 77%. Okay. All right, chat. Well, for uh, the... 61% of you, wait, 61% did or did not want it? Did not want it. The majority did not Yeah, so the 39% of you that want it can join me at the IMAX when it comes back one day, all right? <laughs> Just us. He were withholding his affection yeah. from those who have not seen it. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, it's it's a perfect parenting style that I would not be surprised. Okay, Damiani, what do you think? Well, it says you still got a little bit of the white meter on it when you're targeting it. Everyone's invited, Jack. That. Don't worry. Everyone's invited. White meter? Still, see it under Stego slide? The bar? The white is how much you have left to get rid of. So yeah, we haven't done the you whole you about, exterior. Yeah, yeah, about oh, 20%. this side. We're not talking about the exterior, Damiani. Mm -hmm. How can I judge the interior when it only judges the whole thing? <laughs> I just said that Detective Vision wouldn't show a single drop on Did the you, interior. Are you using Detective Vision? No, I haven't yet, because I, I need Damiani to understand what's happening. Dude, an easy a IMAX takeover is my dream. Huh? Rent a theater. Avatar 2, IMAX, allies count. only, Those let's don't count. Okay. go. Look at that. Not right a there. fucking drop, right there. Damiani. Right there. Um, Where? Gabby disagrees. It's on the, it's on the outside. Purple is on the oh, exterior. Oh, that's on the outside, okay. I'm talking oh. interior only. Not a drop. Damiani the doubter, dude. Power wash, clean queen. You love it. Cody. Clean queen. Cody right here. Ugh. I still gotta put goddamn stray. Everybody else is goatee. You have to play God of War Ragnarok. 
I Ain't no Ragnarok. I can't it came out wait. already. You got a Hubert. You haven't played Rag God of War Ragnarok yet, everyone? I already beat it three times. I'm beat it. <laughs> I decided not to get the plot. JK, JK. I decided not to get the plot. Yeah, I had one raven and I couldn't find it, so yeah, I was like, whatever. Yeah, whatever. That was a good one. Did Did we not. beat it last year. Don't neglect under the spikes, the tail spikes. Oh, wait, I was supposed to go to the top of the other slide. Oh, yeah. Can I go to the top of the slide real quick, just yep. for Gabby? Oh. Yep. Cleaning liquids. Is there a run? You can spray it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, oh. Turn around. I don't know, Dutch. <gasps> it says heart Gabby. <laughs> hey. <laughs> you're gonna ruin cross you out. I was gonna cross you out. It's all your name. It's already botched. <laughs> oh, you're doing it in print. Yeah, I don't have. I don't do that. What script? Yeah. Oh, sick, dude. Awesome. Oh. <laughs> Fucking dope. Sick. I dig it. That's how I write it. That's sick. Looks awesome. See? That's how my signature is. Look at my Twitter profile. It's a really good S. Tanks Bay. Love that S. Would you like it? I will kill you, son! <laughs> It's the opposite of sun. Water. Yeah! Shoot it down! Power water is the opposite <laughs> of sun. <laughs> yeah, finish that stego. Yeah, we gotta clean this thing up. I gotta buy a power washer. I was asking how much. You can, buy a hose. One. you can buy a hose uh, add-on. It's obviously not as good as the real deal, but it's really good and they're cheap. Ah. Just have to get a hose. <laughs> I'm like so incapable of starting things that I have no expertise on. Like I always like need assistance. I need? really want to fucking start growing vegetables, like a tomato. I want to make tomatoes. You have a yard, or just even I have like a front, like kind of shitty garden. brick area, and then I have a really, really small courtyard, like near my computer streaming room, uh -huh. and that's where I put it. It doesn't get a yeah. lot of sunlight in there, though. It's like walled off. It's like this tiny little nook that's like outdoors, but it's like inside my house, kind of. I've well, shown it on chat. I've like panned the camera over. You've seen it. Uh, Not you. But <laughs> I got my mom. My mom has a green thumb and loves to cook. So I, I bought her this little like UV light garden Dope. that you can grow like lettuce and basil and stuff in. Dope. Yeah. Basil, that's a good, so I should do tomatoes and basil. Yeah. That's a good combo, because then I can do like tomato, basil, something. Like, like pasta, pesto. dude. Pesto. But I just, the starting it is always so hard, because it's like, I don't even know where to begin. I don't know just how, buy. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I know nothing, Jon Snow. I, you know, you could just look it up on YouTube. And there's um there's Google, an app. trust on YouTube. There's like <laughs> 40 million videos. There's apps where if you like put in your location and the yeah. name of the plant, it'll tell you when to water it. Fucking sick. Yeah, you'll get a notification. <laughs> Lissy cat, dude. Aww. That's not right. Oh my god. And it seems Ulysses. That's not right. Are we gonna right. go save him in the next mission? No, I'm doing the next mission. Yeah, what the hell? We gotta find it. <gasps> I'm gonna save the cat. That's not right.
You gotta. You should film a Huber syndrome about your plants. That'd be fun. Go to the nursery, pick out some, pick out Dude. a tomato plant. I want to do it so bad. I, mean, I just I don't know how, but I, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to yeah. look it up. I'm gonna watch some YouTube videos. Yeah. And like people have been growing tomatoes for thousands yeah. of years, so they're pretty sturdy. Though I think um. Do you have a lot of like? Do we have groundhogs here in California? Like no, but there is a possum that has just been like all over my house, dude. Like I'll come home and just like the bushes, dude. It's so scary. The bushes will just be like, <laughs> and I hear it like scurrying around. Dude, I was taking out the trash one day and it scared the crap out of me. But you know, possums are awesome to have around. Nice. Because they eat no ticks and they're immune to rabies. Nice. Yeah. No quarrel whatsoever. Yeah. It scared me. They though. do have bad attitudes. One time, um, Isla and our friend Jack were over at our house playing something. So they were leaving really late. Yeah. And Jack went back to our parking lot to get his car. And our local possum was sitting on his car. <laughs> So he called us and he was like, guys, I need help. Like, I'm trying to scare this thing away and it's not leaving. So we all went out and it was like a four person effort to scare this possum away. Yeah. Like she wouldn't move. She wouldn't like, not she, backing would, down. she hissed at us when we got close. Eventually, Isla had a bunch of like bamboo sticks in her car. Oh my God. So we tied the bamboo sticks together and tried to like sweep her oh. off the car. <laughs> Wait, I feel like I have a picture of Jack and the possum. Oh yeah. Oh wow. <laughs> Look at that. Wow. <laughs> yeah, they they're they're intense. I don't know if Chad can see that. Can I hold my phone up? <laughs> can you see that? Jack and the possum. But they cut all the trees down in our parking lot, so it's probably gone. Everyone from cleaning the dinosaur to cleaning the ground below it. Yeah. Here's just gonna end up in the whole park. We yeah. got this, we got this. this I wanna clean this little area, dude. It's very bum, close. Bum, bum, bum. Mindful games right here, Jones. That's probably why he played it. Mm. Mindful games, mm -hmm. dude. We would have got an episode on yep, it. Yep, absolutely. Thanks a lot, Johns. <laughs> 50 hours. 50 hours, dude. Mindful games. Well, you're power washing. Where does all the dirt go? <laughs> Great question. <laughs> Just evaporates. Well, in this game it does, but in real life doesn't. You you're like, like pushing it around. You're pushing it to an edge, I yeah, think. Yeah, you'd right? like spray it out this way. Another use, like, someone's saying last time we played it, like, they use soap and stuff, so, like, it's not just straight water. Like, people use some kind of, like, soap mixture. Yeah. yeah. Which would help dissolve a lot of it. Yeah, I went to the multiverse, yes, chat. It goes, in, it goes into space, and that's all the dark stuff in space. <laughs> that's how it works, exactly, Jack. The darkness in space is the made of dirt. The darkness in space is all the dirt that you power, power washed as a human civilization. You know that would probably maybe make up the distance between the Earth to the moon. Maybe. <laughs> yeah. Which means there's, there's alien life out there, because they must be doing it too. I told my grandpa about aliens last night. Oh yeah? In general or the movie Aliens? In general. Okay. What did he have to say? Oh my grandpa, you think there's aliens out there? He's like, maybe, why haven't we seen it yet? Yeah. <laughs> and I'm just like, grandpa. dude, grandpa, the universe is pretty big. <laughs> and they could be even dumber than us to like not be able to get here, you know? Yeah. He's like, okay. 
Yeah. <laughs> oh, right. Pretty chill. Yeah. Like he's like, that tracks. He's 93, he just got COVID wow. a few weeks ago, and he's recovered. Awesome. Yeah, we got dinner last night, he's jolly. Wow, that's awesome. Yeah. So he was, what year was he born? <laughs> Two minutes later. Yeah, I do that math, I don't know. So 2022 minus 100 is oh, 1922. So 1929. Yeah, wow, so he was born the year of the depression. It's not crazy. That's crazy. That's awesome. Just like talking to him about life and stories is so oh, I'm sure. invaluable. Is he from California? Yes. Born in Los Angeles. Wow. Yep. We've hit it. We've hit it, chat. This is it. <laughs> this, the addiction has begun <laughs> you know you get started on a task and yeah. you've got to see it through to the yeah, end yeah you've yeah. got to see it through we but finish the stegosaurus right <laughs> right the real test of the addiction is when book right. pulls him into the podcast well, we ordered anymore. food everyone's waiting on food blood ordered food, but, I mean, ordered you, food. You, yeah you, you think you can finish this whole level before all that i just want to finish this uh, just, uh, just i was gonna say yeah you, you're gonna be here for a few more hours and you get to try to finish this level you gotta use the yep. uh, yeah apparently there is a time trial mode crazy but that doesn't seem fun to me yeah like i'm limited time this is tough, dude. Holy shit. Stop. Yay! Yay! That feels good. Yeah, doesn't it? Yes. It's right up Huber's alley, right about, about to say. Hmm. In 1973, Halloween actor Donald Pleasance, Dr. Loomis, yep. recorded a voiceover for a drowning PSA that was so frightening it gave children nightmares. Jeez. Oh. That's intense. This area is <laughs> Is it available? I mean, I get to play it through, but like this video I just came across. This spy that says bungee under it. <laughs> I'm steamed. The hell? No, I, here's, I, apparently this might be the video right here. I can play it. This is already scary. Wary, the show off, the fool. And this is the kind of place you'd expect to find me. But no one expects to find me here. It seems too ordinary. But that pool is deep. The boy is showing off. The bank is slippery. <gasps> the show offs are easy. All right, all right. That's so that is scary. Dark. That, that is would give dark. me nightmares. That is not his nightmare. It's gonna give me nightmares now. That is dark. You ever see The Good Son with Macaulay Colgan? Yes. Um, every parent, when I was growing up, every yeah. parent talked about that movie. Yeah. The ending, yep. Does it still hold up? I haven't seen it forever. Same. I just remember him throwing the dummy off the freeway bridge. Yeah. Most insane thing. I like how methodical. What? Feels Satisfying. good. Ben Affleck will return as Batman. Yeah, one more time, right? In Aquaman in the Lost Kingdom. Oh, Aquaman! Yeah. Because they confirmed him for Flash. So now he's in two things? Yeah. And did you see what Keanu Reeves said? No. He wants to play an old Batman. <gasps> Hell yeah. Whoa. Batman Beyond, dude. Batman Do Beyond. It. Do it. 
make it. Give Keanu Reeves what he wants. Yeah. Yes, it is modest. Well, no, it's not Toby Maguire. It's a uh, Elijah, Elijah Wood. Wood and Macaulay Culkin. Yeah. <laughs> it worked. Ooh! Feels nice. That oh, is... it goes ring by ring? God, that's dopamine. Oh my god, that dopamine jump. And the fact that it's like every little piece yes. is like, oh my god, it feels so good. Just from the headphones and listen to that song, Satisfaction. Oh yeah, like listening to a podcast or something while... Well, Playing this, oh, or like an audiobook. That's why I need automated cars so I can play this instead <laughs> of driving. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> yeah, exactly. no other reason. Yep, just for this reason. <laughs> oh! Oh, yeah. Oh, it feels good. Incredible. This green one is doing work. There it is. Oh, so you. Uh, Okay. And it's a ring. Yeah. All the way around. You go lower. And turn it sideways. Uh, yeah, turn it sideways. Tilt the nozzle. Go all the way down. Oh, this way. Yeah, and then go back all the way prone, maybe. Maybe speed uh, road. Yes. Oh, human, limit human limitations. Yep. Oh, this goes like all the way around the whole thing. This is ridiculous. Holy shit! I love this. <laughs> Tracing this thing. Easy living, midnight to 4 a.m. slot. <laughs> yup, yup. Probably put everyone not playing to sleep yeah. in the best possible way. So soothing. The rainbow. It's so nice. The trail. The best detail in the whole game. Yeah. Oh. It really is just watching it go. God, I want a power washer. I have a um like carpet upholstery cleaner nice at home oh so soothing you like spray it with this soapy water and then just push as hard as you can and Hell suck yeah. up the water oh that sounds fun it's it is fun put on some music or a podcast clean your whole couch oh 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 no yep we're, we, we're moving. No. Are you... We're stuck. <gasps> jump. Yeah, we're legit stuck. Jump. No. Prone, jump, prone, move. Jump, prone, move. <laughs> jump, prone, move. Fuck. You want to try, Damiani? <laughs> you try. You'll get us out. Damiani will get us out of there. Save? Or can you... I think it's auto save. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn. We're rolling, man. We were rolling. <laughs> Cut down on your prime. Serious. 
Oh, we have no cleaner attached? Dude, here we gotta buy some shit. Bummer. Needs a patch. Yeah. Needs a patch. We got blasted. Chip blasts yourself out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Grenade <laughs> jump. <laughs> so fun. Grenade jump. Damn. Yeah. Just clean what you can. <laughs> Hopefully it saves. I, mean, I think it does. There's co-op? Mm -hmm. Is it only online? Dude. We gotta find that cat, too. Yeah. Let me go back. I'll load this level and then load back in and see if it fixes. Word. Whoa, this is taking a long time to load. This is a big level. Oh, someone said seven person co op. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let me load back into the other one. Please load. Oh, yeah, resume. Sick. Hopefully, he puts me in again. Loading dirt. I like that. <laughs> there you go. Nice. Check that A. Oh! This edge, dude. It's so satisfying. Be careful when you go back over there. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh... It gives me Mario Party minigame vibes. Turn it, tilt it. Maybe use the yellow muscle. Even this one might work. That one's weaker. Yeah, really weak. Yeah. Be careful. Going towards the... <laughs> the danger zone. <laughs> and remember to trigger to rotate it. So you're shooting it. That's right. Yeah, left trigger, there you go. Oh, I'm expecting that ding. I know. Yes! Yes! yes. Uh, dopamine. Max dopamine. So a long way to go on this level, holy shit. I want this bench. Oh, it does save your progress and you can leave and go to a different place. Yeah. yeah. You just get like bored of one and go to a different one. Thick grime there. Yeah. They should come out with a beat em up prequel to see how all of these locations got so oh. dirty. <laughs> was like Waiting for what game he's talking about to be a prequel, and I was like, oh, he needs this, okay. The year of the beat em up, Dami, honey, we're in it. How many years of the beat em up have we been in? <laughs> Last year was kind of the start, and this year has just been, there's so many good ones. Wait, what year? Due to unforeseen circumstances, the year of the beat em up has been extended. Wait, Future Age 4. Base game came out last year. Actually, it was 2020. It was 2020. I was gonna say, I thought Mr. X was yeah, yeah, nightmare was, it was last, last year. year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because I remember it was like right at COVID times. Because we had to play online. Yeah. 
Bench is no joke. Uh, get under there. Midnight Fight Express chat. That one looks good. Can't wait. It's isometric though. Damiani's out. <laughs> Probably gonna have to ask for the controller or just shut it down because I could just keep playing. I was waiting for the call you the podcast. Yeah. Or your so. food to be here. Yeah. Yeah, no rush. Okay. Get some bamboo sticks and swipe the controller over. Yeah, hey, when's Cobra Kai Damiani? September? Soon. Need it. Very soon. This ground is so insane. It's gonna take yeah. forever. It's scared to take a step in that. like Splatoon in a way where you're like filling in you know yeah, the coloring yeah <sighs> oh yeah ping such a good noise cash register Grand Series was seven this year? Or last year? This year. That's crazy. Chad, I heard there's like 24 episodes of Andor already planned. Seems like a lot for that show. Obi-Wan's out here only getting six. Andor's getting four times as many as Obi-Wan? Maybe because there's just like less, there's more to play with kind of because there's less lore. Sure, 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 sure. You can kind of go crazy, like Mando. Tight. That's my guess, I mean, I don't know shit. We don't know shit about shit. <laughs> Yeah? Nice, food time. Food time, y'all. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> that game chat, holy shit. Holy shit. That is addicting. That That is a dangerous game right there. Dangerous. That's right, Ice. I am dangerous.
thing. Nice. But, pff, let's go straight to the standard point. Mm -hmm. Oh, that sunlight. Beautiful. Oh, blinding. Did you know that shadows can move faster than the speed of light? It's not because they're really moving, though. So, for example, if you shine a light... Drag him up into this bloody game. If you shine, like, a light onto the moon's surface, mm -hmm. but then you use, like, an object to, like, block the light in front of you to cast a shadow, and you do the measurements, it appears as the shadow can move faster than the speed of light, but... The shadow isn't actually moving, though, is the troll. Oh. I was reading something, because people are like, why is, like, shadows can move faster than the speed of light? How come we can't do that? It's like, shadow isn't actually, it's the right, a, it's so, absence yeah. of light, so it's still, yeah, it's still, yeah, it's not movement that's happening there. All right, is that all of that? Don't make me love science. Dun, 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 dun. Oh yeah, you gotta clean the outer uh, ring on the um Oh on the Yeah, yeah. That Oh pizza slices, let's go. <laughs> ding 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 Yo That's so satisfying. So yeah, Shadow the Hedgehog is the fastest. <laughs> That's what I was trying to get at, chat. That was the joke. Yeah. Nice. Alright, now for this disgusting... Rings. The Rings of Death. You know what? It would make a this would make a good thing for Twitch plays. What do you mean? Twitch plays Power Watch Simulator, so the Twitch chat controls oh. it. Oh, <laughs> yeah. that would be awesome. Where's, That's a great idea. Where is this? Why is it not? Is it already there? Did it already happen? And I missed the boat. Chat. Oh, you're trying to do it right now. Up. Okay, up. <laughs> up. So it's a right first. Right. Right. No, I'm kidding. L2. <laughs> Down. Rotate. <laughs> Having those beams in the realism. Oh dear, this spot right here is just making me upset. Come on. Yeah. Uh, uh, ding for me. All right, this yellow part. Next <laughs> challenge. Okay. Uh, the other edge first. It's the straight thing. It's not straight from right. Uh, you guys can't stop either. Look who's back. I love it. Guess who's back. You can't stop. Back again. What are you talking about? You're the one who's back. <laughs> you, I figured you're like, all right, that's it. No, you were just back for more chat. What did Anybody you want some chicken to karage? What is that? Oh, it's fried. I wish. Tell me, it's just fried chicken. It's good. Oh yeah. Do you know, it, Do you know what's? If you know what's it, it meant. It meant like. It's not spicy. That's it's okay. Savory. I don't even know what's in it. There's like onion. Is there I any smell. chance it's uh, flavored with shellfish? 
Great question. It was not under seafood. Okay. It was under chicken. Japanese cooking I'm technique, most often soy. chicken, deep fried in oil. That's fine. Oh, Lightly coating small pieces of the meat with flour or potato or corn mm -hmm. starch and frying it in a light oil. Yes. The foods are marinated prior to coating. That's the question, yeah. The what? process di differs from the preparation of tempura, which is not marinated. Huh. Often served alone or with rice and shredded cabbage. I'm sure it's fine. I think you should be good, but uh, let's hope. Let's hope so. Mm. Is that good? I hope so. This yeah. is a rice bowl thing, or what? What was? I thought you were saying this was something else. I already ate that. This is this is my other <laughs> part of the meal. Uh, okay. Those, uh, you know, you can get them in like Japanese markets. Chat. It's like a triangle. They sell them in uh, yakuza. The oh, yeah. oh, onigiri. Had, yeah, onigiri. onigiri yeah. yeah, I had one of those for lunch. Yep, I had one of those and some karage. You know why Korean fried chicken is so good? Please tell me because it's so because, good. Because, another Gabby fun fact. Because Korean chefs were taught by African American GIs during World War II, I assume. Yeah. Yeah. Dude. Keep the facts coming. <laughs> <laughs> I hope they're not annoying. <laughs> okay, I forgot about the auto fire. There we go. I've been doing this the hard way. I've been holding on the trigger the whole time. I was like, why is my finger starting to hurt? It didn't hurt the last time we played this game. I was like, oh yeah, auto fire. Gabby facts. Gabby facts. I'm full of them. Do you know where, where we get the word? Okay, okay wait. Oh. I learned this recently because I read a book about the history of salt. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. salt. <laughs> um, so soldiers used to be paid in salt, which is where we get the word soldier, but it's also where we get the word salary. That's crazy. Yeah, and that's also where we get the expression, like, worth your salt. Ah. Uh, interesting. That is a good one. <laughs> salt. Well, you're t I wanted, oh. the reason I gave it, like, an unenthusiastic is because, uh... Okay. Not because it was in interesting, but like I'm still fascinated by. Uh, um, oh my gosh, Korean. Uh, bim bim bop. Mm. No. Prepared chicken. Thank you. Because like I'm sorry, my mind is went on auto autopilot <laughs> off. Uh, so uh, the year I was back in Texas, there was a Super H Mart by not too far from where I was, mm -hmm. and uh, was very thankful to have one not too far from me. But the thing is, they had like a little food courtyard there as well. And they had a mom oh, pop. Sorry, Screaming Argonaut. Yes, that's the book I read. History of Salt by Mark Kolinsky. Nice. It was really interesting. They had a mom sorry. pop shop that made the best Korean fried chicken mm. I've ever had because they had a. The, whatever. It was like they looked orange and they were more like a kind of like wet, not dry, but mm. like a wet coating around mm -hmm. them. And then like, a, I don't know, it was like kind of like a thick coating. And it was very like succulent, yeah. Like to bite into. So good. And I found out a month after I moved out, uh, moved back here, they went out of business. I've oh. never had anything. I know they exist. I know there's places that make them similar yeah. to that. I need to go to one. I keep forgetting to go to one. Um, Jesse Boy. Jesse Boy's in Hollywood. Okay. Um, it's a Basically, Korean fried chicken and Korean fried tofu as well. Um, or um, fried cauliflower. Cause then the other one that was big out here, one of the first ones, banchan, go out like a long time ago. Banchan means like side dishes. But they so actually like kimchi is a banchan as well, and they that was the name of the that. restaurant. Yeah. Ah. So probably not very creative with the name either. No, that's cute. Side dishes. You want the rest? I have, I have ramen. You're good. Yeah. Damiani. I can't eat it. I want to so badly though. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry to tempt you, bro. <laughs> well, it's like I could, but like I have yeah. leeway each day and yeah. I already use some. Because yeah, yeah. I had sushi today, but Don't it, had press it. it has a little bit of rice. Like I kind of hit my limit for the day, nice. unfortunately. Went to the gym yesterday with Brad again. Oh, yeah? Yes! Nice. What do you do at the gym? Just the basic shit, just normal lift, lifting things. Oh, bon chon. <laughs> Sorry. Like, like little. Like I do. Or like, or like, power lifting. No, no, no. Just like some curtains, some dumbbells. Oh. Yeah. Like. I'll say Soul Weaver. 
Um, Brad apparently hates cardio because he's a freak. Wait, so who likes I'm gonna cardio? do. Huh? Who likes cardio? I like cardio. I love cardio. Chad, I'm I'm weird. I like cardio with no headphones. I like oh, to go weird. on a run huh. and listen to oh. the sound of the world. Okay, outdoor is different yeah. than being on like yeah, a yeah, treadmill yeah. or yeah, like I can do cardio. a peloton yeah. or something. And like, oh I love my sports. God. That was so oh, blinding. <laughs> I like. I thought my laugh, my light flashed a little before my eyes right there. Am I blacking out? <laughs> it's like, whoa. Sorry, you're saying. Um, like sports, all that I can do, but running on a treadmill, no thank you. Yeah, I don't like the treadmill. It's so boring. If I'm gonna run, I, it's gotta be outside. Or biking, love biking. Yeah. Uh, I, I also it. really, really, I'm really, really, really love yoga, like a lot. Have you done Pilates ever? No. I have not done yoga in years, and I'm trying to like get back into yeah. it. Yeah, just do like YouTube in. videos or whatever. Well, the gym I go to has classes, like classes? it's included mm -hmm. with, so I'm gonna try to do that. <clears throat> Love it. It's good. It, it's making me feel good, Chad. Just like getting to the gym, like in your body. It's so nice that feeling when you're done yeah. with the gym. Yeah. And it's like, time. dude, I just worked out healthy style, and normally I'd still be asleep. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Like, oh, I'm in getting morning, into a workout yeah. before I'd even get up. Oh. What time are you usually? Like, I don't do that. We go, no, we go at noon. Oh. oh that's not, okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, I forgot. This is in Hubert time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta remember Huber this. Yeah. Yeah. Hubert time here. I gotta remember this. Yeah. Yeah, no. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta resume my walks. I haven't gone on one in this whole month. I started them in. May okay. and I stopped in July because of the heat. There is no no shaming of night owls, right? No. Because my therapist Not at all. talked about the sickest fucking thing. Because I was talking about how I stay up so late and it's like kind of unhealthy, whatever. Like I wish I could go to bed a little earlier, but it's just like really hard for me to get on that s schedule. Mm -hmm. And she's like, "Yo, since ancient times, like." cave people you would have like the gatherers the hunter gatherers like doing shit in the day and then you would have the people at night that would stay up all night yeah. and like protect the area and You're, that's it that's you that's yeah so you, know, you protect something else it's like we're all <laughs> protecting my house oh, dude. yeah but like just the vibe of like dude humans have been on that like day night cycle forever it's like some of us are night owls some of us are morning people some of us are you know afternoon whatever yeah the uh farmers used to like before there was electricity they would like you know, get up at five o'clock in the morning or yeah. four o'clock in the morning, uh, whenever the sun rose, yep. farm, and then take a nap for a couple hours, yeah. get up, work some more, and then, you know, go to sleep when the sun set, wake yep. up in the middle of the night, and read, oh, and that's... then go back to sleep, yeah. and then wake up and start working again. Yeah. My schedule got completely fucked when I was a teenager and I started working in restaurants. I mean, that's it. That's it. Yeah. You're done. You're getting off work at 11 or midnight you gotta eat, you gotta come home, usually you gotta shower so you don't smell like beans or rice. <laughs> like, just standing in like Chinese food, just like yeah. all of it, you know? Chinese food exhaust, yeah. So it's like, you can't, you gotta get, get food and unwind, and it's like, by the, you know, maybe it's watch something, it's two, three in the morning, yeah. that's it. Like I fucked up my, I mean, I was always a night owl, but in college, I set it up so, I live kind of far away from campus. Yeah. So I set it up so I only had class two days a week. Yes. So I had four day weekends for three years. Yeah. So my schedule oh to my this gosh. day is fucked. <laughs> oh my god. Like two two days two weekend days not enough for me. Yeah. So I'm like where's Love, the other I'm two? RP. I'm gonna RP. Sorry, keep going. <laughs> no, no, I'm done. I'm done. He wants me right now. He said emergency. So new. Said new nice. right now. <gasps> said rush job. Rush job. Rush job. Hundred bucks. <laughs> Yo, hundred bucks. Sick. See how fast this goes. RP hype. Sorry, I, I did what you did, but my senior year of college. Yeah. I wasn't able to make it, arrange that. I but. did it every single year. The Bear is incredible. Episode one, just those little restaurant moments, because I was never a, I never worked in a deli and I was never a cook. But the, right in the first episode, when they're like, family meal, it's like, yeah, family meal hype. It's the best, dude. Family meal before a shift. Everyone's just palling around. Good vibes, dude. The bear rules. What's that actor's name? Jeremy White? I forgot. 
I think it's Jeremy White. So I saw a tweet that said, Jeremy White is the working woman's Timothy Chalamet. <laughs> it's really good. Yeah, like prime review hours chat when I'm like writing a review is like midnight to 4 a.m. Oh wow. That's when I do my best. Right? That's when I get like my good shit. Dude. I, I sh yeah, I mean, I'll, I, I can do it in the evening sometimes, but I generally try and do it like late afternoon. Like late night, I get worried that I'm gonna like. Yeah. I usually start in the day. Yeah. You're not eating yet? But then I go all the way. Yeah. Are we Look ready? Who's summoning the Let's do it. I don't think we're waiting on for it. Oh, okay. Sorry. Right. Yep. Except Hold on. For me. <laughs> later, chat. Love you. See you later. Are you on the podcast? Love you. Yep. You got me. <laughs> <laughs> I do want to eat. I am going to eat. All right. Enjoy your food. Nom, 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 nom. Yeah, Jeff, this is a rush job. Very quick, very fast. I get back to the other job. Very quick chat. Two in the morning, can't stop watching. That's right. I propose that we just make easy chilling just this the whole time. Does we stream the full thing of this game? We don't stop. We just, we do it in we do it in blocks. Dude, ding 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 ding. Ding 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 dopamine 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 Yo, keep it up keep that dopamine up ding 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 all day long I need those dings ding 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 There, this tire. There we go. There we go. There we go. What about the other tire? All oh, right, it's the tires. It's the tires. Yeah, it's the tires. Ding, 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 ding. The canopy, front canopy, and the windshield. Okay. So the inside of the windshield is probably dirty. There we go. Ding. Okay. Front canopy support these. Okay. Ding. Let's get the outside. Hmm. Oh, that was it. All right, and then. Ding, rush job. We did it. Very good job. How much time did that take? Does it tell you how long it took for? It's almost like it didn't happen. What 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 happened here? Got soiled. What's the whole thing? I want more backstory. All right, we're at the playground. Do we have any new ones? 
That, sorry, that was a good sneeze. That was a good sneeze. I have leather car seats. I don't know if I'd power wash those. All right, we're going back to the back to the playground of death. I remember this though, same setting as. Oh yeah, we're doing this. We're getting the red done. Sad, sad action right here. There we go. Will I stream Xenoblade 3? I've been debating. Dad. Been debating whether or not to do that. I don't know. Because I'm reviewing it, probably not. Might not do. Might need to like focus on that game and not have distractions, unfortunately. Definitely. Definitely can focus more when I play a game just on its own without having to stream it, so. And given what happened with 2, with me getting confused by the battle system, I think it would be best if I just like kind of focus on the game itself. I promise I'll stream Rebirth. I will do a full playthrough of FF7 Rebirth for all of you. That is a promise. I know that's probably like one of your most anticipated. A lot of people would skip those streams unless. Oh, their head. I, I read it as unless they heard you. I'm like, heard me? Well, like, what? Uh, uh, yeah, oh, they would need to be ahead of me. Uh, rebirth, I will start. I will delay start. I won't start Rebirth right away. I'll give people, like, a day head start. Definitely give people a head start for, for Rebirth. How to you... How do you keep track of your diet. Uh, for me, the easiest way is clothes sizes. I have, now I've been doing it for two years. Each January, I've had to buy new pants, like smaller pants. So my goal is by January of next year to go down another pant size, but I am pretty sure one more pant size is going to be my limit. Uh, in my adult life, since being like a, a, a 18 year old or older, and I was probably the most fit in my life when I was 18 because I was a athlete in high school, um, played like all three sports at one point, and uh, by that football, baseball, basketball, um, the smallest waist size I've ever had is a 36 for my body type. So 36 inches is the smallest waist I've ever had as an adult body. Um, I can't go smaller than that. And I'm in a 40 right now, so my goal is to hit 38. Hit a 38 by uh, January. So that is where I'd like to be. And I will, I will settle for that as being awesome. I mean, I'm pretty happy right now. Um, more than the waist size, I would like to... I'd like to go down one more shirt size. That is the goal. That's like the, like the big goal. Because the shirt size is a little bit harder than the waist size. Yeah. I don't know, uh, I don't think I could go smaller than a 30. 36 is like my limit for my waistline. Going smaller than that, I don't think, I would start going the other direction and be unhealthy under, I'd be underweight to go for my body type. I, uh, I don't think I can go below that. 
I, I think that would start. I'd have to start going, approaching an unhealthy weight, and I don't want to do that. I want to. I don't want to swing the other way. Yeah. Um, uh, shirt size, like, I want to fit into any kind of XL shirt, no matter like what brand or whatever. That is like well, I'd be su that like super happy. Anything better than that is like amazing, but. Right now, uh, I'm double. I went down from triple to double. I'm in double XL now, um, and I'd like to get down to XL. But the that I've noticed has been a little bit slower, uh, for sure. When I track to eat, I'm, I repeat what I eat each week. I almost eat the same things on every single day. So Wednesdays is uh, Zankow chicken. I go to Wednesdays. I go to Zankow chicken for lunch to get my salad bowl. Um, and then for dinner, did I finish this? No, I didn't. I'm missing some stuff. Oh, over here. Uh, and then for now for dinner, because I had to replace something because I went out of business. Uh, I do uh, a salad, a Southwestern grilled chicken salad um, from Chili's, but I don't get the tortilla strips on it. I have them not do the tortilla strips. So it's this pico de gallo lettuce grilled chicken, and uh, I do the, I do this. It's like the Santa Fe sauce, but it's not a lot, so it's like a tiny container, so it's fine. It's ne negligible. I only have a cheat meal on Saturday. Cheat day, sorry, not a meal. I have two meals on Saturday. I only also I only eat twice a day. I only eat two meals a day, and then I have a bag of almonds, blue diamond almonds that I snack on. That is, that is my other thing. I don't eat three meals a day. I only eat two meals a day. That probably helps a lot because I don't calorie count at all. I don't do calorie counting. Like, when we get into the nitty-gritty, like, maybe having to, like, the last push, I might have to start doing that. But so far, I've been lucky that I don't have to do calorie counting. All my weight loss has been without doing any calorie counting yet. Yeah. I'm not at that point where it's, like, the really tough shit where you really do need to start doing that. So. Don't do step count, either. I'm very, I, 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 I'm very bad at exercise. I'm very bad at exercise. So like, while well, I'm gonna be at a healthy weight, I still need to like, the next task is like, really getting on my case to start walking more consistently because healthy weight isn't enough. You have to like, exercise. Like you can be at healthy weight, but you're still like, not healthy. Like, you won't get, you won't get like, obese related, you won't be at more risk because of obesity anymore, but, the lack of activity is going to contribute to stuff as well, so like, God, I need to really get on that because, yeah. Basically, I was told I need to take care of all this. Sh I, like, basically, I was given a deadline. Uh, my doctor was like, "You have until you're 40 to take care of this your weight issue and stuff. You have all like you have time. You have all this time, but like, if you don't start taking, if you don't take care of it by 40." When you hit your 40s, you're gonna start seeing issues, and it's gonna start becoming irreversible. So like, you got till you're 40 to reverse any of this damage that you've done, and like, that, it was, it's up to you whether you want to do anything about it. So, as I hit my mid 30s, like, okay, I should probably do something now. I should probably do this before it gets too late, so I don't like die, right? And it's like, I, I also knew I had to make, it had to be a routine. I'm like, this can't just be a gimmick diet that I do for a month. Oh, I lost 30 pounds in a month. Holy shit, this is great. Going back to eating whatever the fuck I want. Like, and then like do it again every so often. I was like, no, this needs to like, yeah. I was like, what's the best thing you can do? It's like, compromise. Six days a week, you're going to eat what you need to eat. And on seventh day, on Saturday, sorry, I didn't make, mean to make a re religious reference there, but like on the seventh literal day, on Saturday, for me, you can mostly eat what you want. Like, 
I some got I can't go too overboard, but like you can have two meals of whatever the fuck you want to eat. So it's like go to Five Guys, have burgers and fries. Go to fucking like Raising Canes and have a fucking Caniac combo with like all the fries and sauces you want and shit. And that's it. So like now Saturdays, I like I look forward to Saturdays. Like dude, Saturday I can eat. Oh, I want, like I I mean. It's been diminishing returns. There's actually been some Saturdays. I'm like, I don't care what I eat today. I'm like, and I'm like halfway through the day and I haven't eaten yet. I'm like, are you gonna eat anything today? Like for a cheat meal or are you, just, are you not? <laughs> I'm like, uh, yeah, I should probably go get something for everything. Oh no, the Gabby stuff. Sorry, Gabby. Everyone's recording the podcast to me. I'm just waiting to out traffic. I'll be here for one more hour and then I'll drive home. Sorry, Gabby. Do the yellow part first. Da, da, da. Actually, the slide never got finished, did it? It was a good run. We have it on stream. Oh, that's not the slide. Okay. There's something up there, I guess. There's there, oh no, there's grime down here still. Holy crap! Sorry, let's just finish the slide. It's so close. There we go. But like, I don't eat a lot of candy anymore, period. Like, cheat days, I don't... Like, maybe once every two, three months, I'll, like, get a candy bar. Like, chocolate bar. I don't eat a lot of candy anymore, period. Um, chips. Lot, do eat a lot of chips on cheat day, though. Chips, I don't think I'll ever be able to get rid of. I just like chips too much. They're too good. But, yeah. The other thing that's helped is if, like, I... If I am during the week, I am just like hungry and I'm, I know I'm gonna eat something I'm not supposed to eat, I try and mediate it by not eating a lot of it. For example, uh, like I get a craving for chips and stuff, and like usually if I'm in the right mindset, I'll be like, go get, go buy a pack of pork rinds, cause they're, they have no carbs. So I'm like, and it'll satisfy that salty, crunchy snack, possibly. But if not, there are those super tiny bags of like chips, like Doritos, like like they're like baby packs that like, it's like a handful and you eat, you eat the handful. It's like just a handful of chips, like reaching to a big bag, taking a handful and that's it. It's not even like a normal bag. And it's like, do that and then be done. And it's like, so it's like about mm, also minimizing like the bad stuff you're eating. If you're gonna eat bad stuff too, like don't eat a lot of it. Yeah, I know that me I know that technically messes with like with ketosis, but like at the same time, it's like I had like early on in my diet, there'd be like some days where I just I failed. I was like, I'm going to eat a whole fucking big bag of chips. Like I can't stand this. Or uh, I I had a bad day. I'm going through fast food and getting like a burger, large fries, and, like two large burgers and large fries. I don't give a fuck. So, don't have that happen anymore. It's like, oh man, I'm just like dying of like, I, I can't, I don't know, I'm not gonna make it to Saturday for whatever reason, I need something now. It's like, go to the grocery store, go to like the kids like snack aisle. It's like, oh, here's like a thing, like a tiny thing of like Doritos or whatever. It's like, we actually, it's actually the ones they buy for the guys here. They have them here. I see them snacking on it. Which is, like, kind of tempting. But thankfully, we have a lot of almonds and peanuts here that I can eat instead. So. I don't cook. I'm, I mean, I choose not to cook. And I don't... I honestly don't feel that bad about it. I really don't. I understand it's a great, useful skill. It could potentially save money with inflation and shit. I mean, it caught up. Like, fast food prices eventually did go up and out. And, like, it, 
For a little while there, it was faster, to, it was cheaper to eat out than buy groceries. There was a little window where I was like, huh, it is actually cheaper to eat out. This is kind of hilarious, but then there, all the out-to-go food went up in price too. I was like, oh, okay, there we go, it caught up. Um, it's a time thing. It's strictly a time thing. I'm lazy and I, I like watching a lot of shit. I like playing a lot of games that aren't for work. How, how, how the hell do you think I play Final Fantasy XIV sometimes? I give up an, like an hour or two hours of cooking time. Final Fantasy XIV time, baby. 15 minute trip to go get some food somewhere. Bank the rest of that time playing Final Fantasy XIV, baby. Is this not, where's the rest of this blue? Oh my god, there's gotta be a whole other side I missed. It, I, it goes this way, doesn't it? Oh, now there's a yellow Pac-Man thing here. Dude, I, I missed, I missed the boat. All those, all those the, the, there's a handful of big 14 content creator streamers. I really don't know how much they make, honestly. I'm not privy to that. Like, I totally could be making more than them doing easy ally stuff. I have no idea. But, like, judging by the deals, the, the partnerships they have, like, they get some of the ones that, A, we've ever, we've possibly had in the past, and or they get ones we wish we had. I'm like, I think they might make more money than me, so... I feel I like I was too scared to commit to that. Should I uh, like missed the boat? Now it's wait. They can't do it now. The only, you have to like you can't do that. You'd have to like be get big in another game genre category on Twitch, and then like start get really known that way, and then jump into other games. Like I can't. I don't think you could jump into 14 right now and be like, I'm gonna become a big 14 streamer. It's like mm, kind of kind of at its like saturation at this point that too there's no guarantee but i mean like the night i mean also the nightmare interview what i wouldn't have been able to do that like i keep saying like oh i could have like the nightmare interview could have been a launching point but it's like yeah but then would you have access to that ever again yeah you got so these are the questions you got to think through whatever a lot of you are thinking about jumping into like content creation and stuff like you, you gotta have a hard discussion with yourself like and have realistic expectations yeah i don't want to do vtuber um i'm glad it exists but like it doesn't seem like it's a thing for me Well, here's the thing. I don't think it's about watching. So here's the two things I think I'm, and actually I might try something. There's something I want to try. Um, so l let me, re re like, let me get all that package. Cause that was a lot. My brain just took on a lot there. And now I just like forgot how I'm going to say it. So let me start with the first thing um, that I was going to say. Cause the other thing is easier to remember. Um, I think the conversation that people have during 14 streams or why people stay. It's not necessarily about the content they're doing. It's about what the, they, 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 they constantly are talking about something and it's like interesting to the chat. And thus the chat feels like they're engaging with them. And so they're really not there for the 14 necessarily. They like the personality. So theoretically that streamer would be good with any game. As long as they can play a game, they would just be a good Twitch streamer. So that way, they're just a good personality. So I think that is one angle um, that, that works a lot. And I think with the, the, some of the best 14 streamers, yes, a lot of them happen to be good at the game and do like good content. But th I think the ones that have like lasted the longest, it's because they can they present well, they talk well, they have very good like presentation and, and talking skills, like social skills. So honestly, I think that's the most important thing for that. However, I was about to like say the second part. The second part is, and it could apply to 14 is community, community engagement, still a form of engagement, but 
there are some big streamers on 14 who their job is it's it is part it is talking but they make it easier on themselves because what do they do they play with their community they constantly do content with their community um, and thus they're talking with your community um, uh, and that's another way to do it so like they don't have to be the greatest at like maybe holding a conversation themselves because they got other people to talk with now um, so like helping people clear content streamers uh, or another like thing that I think are some of the biggest 14 streamers so here an idea I have that I might want to try out I don't know the situation with our static um, I don't know if we're like I don't know what's up if we're even going to do this tier or not, or we're going to start late, or we, uh, how, how many members we need to replace. But, like, should it, like, maybe not work out? Like, I still want to raid with them. Like, maybe we just need, a, like, some time or a tier off or something, and we'll get back together. But should I somehow not have a static for Savage, an idea I'm floating around in my head is maybe I see a lot of the EZA members raiding lately. It's like, and I don't, I'm in no rush. I don't care when I clear the damn phase. Like, I've already cleared shit, like, in timely fashion. And, like, it's not about clearing it fast. And, yeah, I was like, may we get seven of members from the Easy 8 community that are already into, interested in raiding or want to try raiding, and we just do the current tier as, like, an Easy 8 community. And I could totally, uh, I could totally coach. <laughs> Or someone else is more knowledgeable, like more like more of a veteran. I they happily can take over the, the call out duty, but like I could like do what I normally do, which is like I learn the fights ahead of time, or watch all the existing stuff that's out there, even if it's just streams of this new content, and uh, you know do that. That's an idea I had. Because it'd be like slow casual like pacing pretty much. It would not be like, yo, we're clearing this week one or probably not even the first month. Imagine it'd probably take like six to eight weeks. In the worst case scenario. Like maybe a little, like maybe like maybe a month is like closer to realistic. Uh, but that's an idea. Maybe and if it's not this tier, maybe the last savage tier could be an idea. But yeah. I healed a party in your reclear run. I was in uh, I was in a DRS static on Discord. Like most, like I mean, we I know we had subs and stuff, but like was it that group? Because I did all ten of my DRS clears with that group. At least the leaders were the same. I'm not coaching Kyle. That would be punishment. You know what? If you want to make a want, want stakes for a new betting special, me forcing me to have to coach Kyle through any kind of extreme or harder fight would be punishment to me. That would be the worst. I mean, may, if he takes it seriously, then maybe actually wouldn't be that bad. But like, if he's gonna like display first person and just like, I, I like maybe he's tell, he makes the, says I'm gonna learn by doing. I'm gonna be like, no. No, I'm out. <laughs> I he, he took uh it takes two seriously. We did that pretty seriously. I mean we're having a good time, but like we were not like trying to actively troll or anything like that. We actually like played it normally. I guess that's what I mean. Like if, if Kyle's just like open minded and plays like that. Actually, it'd be, it wouldn't be bad at all. It'd actually be probably a pretty fun time. But yeah, if he's gonna run towards every AOE, or take the stack marker away from everybody every time, that might be a little frustrating. Talk cats for half an hour? I can do that. I was really worried there's gonna be DLC for Stray. And I can't say what I thought it was going to be because it'd be a spoiler, but like, I was real, I was like, oh my god, if they show it, if they show this and it's, it's what I'm thinking of, I'm going to like lose it, but it wasn't, and it doesn't exist. <coughs> Sneeze into your arm, not into your hand. There you go.
Is this still the green? Oh my. Wait, do I think it's down here? Oh, that's a wall. Hmm? Oh no, he just doesn't know the mechanics. That's fine. They're changing Moogle Mog. Moogle Mog's getting changed in 6.2. So Kyle, if he hasn't done King Moogle, I mean, he had to for the story, but um, he'll never have to do it again. It's getting changed. Because it's the first required hard mode trial. And it's, it's kind of confusing because no fights really follow that formula anymore. So it's not a great introductory fight. I, I, I agree with the reasoning with the developers. Well, I sort of wish there was a way for them just to make two versions of it, leave the existing version alone. But like when you queue, but it, you have to specifically pick that one to queue into it. But like if you ever use Duty Finder or Roulette, you would get the new version. You could never accidentally get into the old version. I wish they would keep the old versions of both the dungeons and stuff. Keep them in there, but they're optional and you have to manually check them to go into them. Whereas like through Duty Finder, they're just not there anymore. Like that would be, that's my perfect solution for that. I really wish they would do that, but I, I kind of guess maybe if it's too much resources, it's better just to like do the new one. All right, this green floor is so much more. Where are we missing? Oh, it goes over here, shit. Oh my good lord. I should probably just do this while I can here. Just, no. Just stick to your guns. Yeah, this is this part's stressful. Uh, but yeah, our last session of. Uh, so when you said DRS, I thought of uh, DSR. I thought Dragon Song were prize, not uh, Delubrum Regine Savage. Sorry, that's why I was getting confused when you said that earlier. But you healed. I'm like, wait a second. I've only had one healer. I was like, huh? Um, and we got we got to phase seven like five or six times our last session. But <laughs> we couldn't get to the like. So there's only three mechanics in the fight. Three sets of mechanics. We didn't get to the last set of mechanics. Uh, not like the rotation, that where it repeats, but it does three mechanics and repeats those three times, except the last repeat. It doesn't do all the mechanics at the end. It goes into an rage. Uh, there's three major mechanics in each cycle. They just repeat three times. Uh, we haven't seen a single cycle once through. The last mechanic of a cycle, we haven't been alive to see. Something always goes wrong during our first Aukmorn's Edge, and it's like, uh, or it's earlier, and I'm like, ah. Uh, and that's like the one I need to see, because that's like the hardest for healers. I'm like, all right, I just need to see this once in real time. Um, but yeah, we're uh, we're really close. I My personal goal, I mean, we already exceeded my personal goal, because we made it. I was hoping like we'd average maybe like one or two phase sevens a pull. We did like five in our last session. So I'm like, okay, we were really focused that day. That was really good. And we broke our curse of the post break. We usually never make it to our furthest prog in our post break. Uh, we made it to our furthest prog in post break. I was like, well, I was like, that's good. We broke that curse because it was kind of weighing on some people. It's not good to have jinx curses and shit when you're this close. But anyway, uh, my personal goal is I hope we see Enraged this week. I, I think we could clear if we focus and see Enraged sooner than later, but this weekend coming up. Um, but like, we're getting close. Like, I think worst case scenario within the next three weeks. Three weeks is worst case scenario. Best case this week. Realistically, I think we clear next week. We'll see some enrages this week, possibly. Um, but I'm up. You know what? Every time I've set a thing, or my group has exceeded it. Or say our group. It's not like my group. But like, our group has exceeded it. So, yeah. Unfortunately, not going to do it before Xenoblade. The Xenoblade Chronicles 3, before the release of it, was my, like, pie-in-the-sky hopeful goal. That was, like, a th the three-month marker. I was like, oh, my gosh. Can we just clear it in three months? And, like... 
this fight does not fuck around, man. <laughs> I'm not, like, you want a test of patience and mental endurance? This is the, this fucking fight, man. I'm pretty good with 14 in terms of, like, I can play the game for hours on end. Sit and, like, sit, like, like, I can do PvP forever. It's, well, not forever, but, like, a long time. And, like, I can do content for a long time. But this fight is like, uh, there, there it, the mental, mental toll it takes, I think, is n n something to not, you know, just don't, doesn't toy around, man, it is legit. All right, this green floor is, oh, I already got it. What am I doing? All right now the red. Let's get this red circle. Let's work my way out, out and in. Uh, I already told my group this is the last ultimate I'm doing uh, at launch. I'm not. I'm not doing ultimate prog ever again like this. I can't commit this much time. Like even weekends, it's. I want my free time back. I don't want to, have to play Final Fantasy XIV. Every weekend, every Friday, Saturday, Sunday night, I'm like, nah, I'd like to do some other shit. I mean, for like a month, maybe, but like, this is now three months, so we're gonna be going to the fourth month after this week. It's like, mm mm. Mm mm. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. It's actually what I hated about OG rating. The very first stack I was in, it would take us the whole raid tier to clear a raid. Both the uh, second coil and the uh, final coil took us all six months. We literally, oh, sorry, five months. Five months and five months. Four and a, wait, we started a month into second coil, uh, or a few weeks into second coil, we didn't start at launch. We cleared it the final weekend before uh, the next tier dropped, before final coil dropped. Um, and in Final Coil, uh, I actually cleared it while playing on the game trailers, uh, Twitch. Um, it's like about four months, three or four months. It's like about three or four months. I hated that pace. It was, I hated having to do a fight that long. Um, but ever since, uh, ever since, Al well, that's not true, because A3S was... Like the late 3S was the last straw. I was like, fuck fights that take months to clear. I'm done with this. Thankfully, starting the next tier, found groups that did not take all fucking day. Well, the Alexander the Creator saved rating, in my opinion. Uh, it saved it for me, at least. Uh, I was about ready to give up rating uh, after Midas. I was like, why the fuck? They said Midas was easier. Midas is fu to me, Midas was way harder. A8S is way harder than anything they'd ever made before. I was like, what is this bullshit? They're lying out their ass. I was like, this sucks. I was like, um, I guess this is just not for me, you know. And then they made the creator, and like, creator was good. Like, I'm sure the best players were not happy with it, but like, the rest of the rating community was like, thank you. Thank you for making something we can do again that doesn't like take up all our time. Does this game support VR? I don't know, actually. Does anyone know? I actually don't know. I'm playing on Xbox, so I don't know. I don't know if the PC version supports it or not. There are mods, but not officially? Okay. Plus, they're starting to make other types of hard content. As he said, like, DR Savage was good. DR, like, uh, Deliver and Regine. That was actually fun. Um, I, I mean, it took a lot of commitment, but, like, it wasn't, it wasn't as much time. It didn't take as much time as, a, like, an ultimate. DRS was about, like, four weeks. About four weeks. Um... I mean, maybe I was lucky with the group I was in, but, like, it took four weeks to clear it. And that was, like, two days, two days, like, Saturdays and Sundays. Like, four hours on Saturday and four hours on Sunday, I think. Yeah. 
the Criterion Dungeons I'm very interested in, like, how they play out. Because that could be a solution for people who don't have... People that have enough time for Savage and don't want a Party Finder uh, either. Because I, I understand why people Party Finder. Uh, they want flexibility. The statics require time commitment. Um, and not everyone can do that. And it shouldn't be the only way to raid. Because people who show up... There are some people who probably play more time uh, than, the, uh, than some static people do. In, in a week on 14, but the problem is that time can't be predictable. It's like they they, they, can't, they don't know when they're gonna be able to play, or it's hours where not a lot of people are playing um, for that are looking for static, so then your route, you gotta go as Party Finder. But now you need like eight people still to do that. It's still like kind of a hard thing to get. I mean, it's easier but not the easiest so a four person content at that difficulty means it's like probably going to take less prog time um and easier to get people together to do it so i think that actually might the the i think the criterion dungeons have the possibility to become the new main form of like difficult content for casuals it might rip like ex primals and criterion dungeons could be it And then I would actually say, like, Savages might be dropped. Like, Savages might be seen as, like, oh, it's more of a time commitment and stuff. Like, I'm, I'm curious about the repercussions of what, what happens. Uh, like, the impact it has. Like, how people view Savage after Criterion comes out. Because there are people who don't, don't want to even do, like, a month of something. They're like, I don't want to do something for a month. Like, I just want to do it in a week and be done and move on to another game. Which is what, what EXs are. EXs are basically, like, most casual people will clear an EX fight in a week. When they start on it, within a week they'll probably get their first kill. Two weeks, probably on the up higher end. I'm guessing these dungeons are gonna take like a week at most for some like for the like on the high end for some casual players. Maybe not the hardest difficulty. There, there are three difficulties. So I forgot to say there are three difficulties. The hardest difficulty is very likely gonna be a little bit more restrictive. But for the two other ones, I think those will be uh, those will be, like I mean the normal ones are gonna be like everyone clear at day one, but like. The equivalent of the EX version will be like a week for some people. Yeah. I don't think like some people, the, the appeal of doing a fight for so long doesn't, like, it's not for everybody. And even for people it's for, I think it has diminishing returns over time. So you will get burnt out at some point. Alright, what am I at? This is good. Okay, the small red. I didn't finish the small red, which means it's probably in here. Oh yeah, disgusting. Oh, dang, that was part of the yellow. Whoa, this is kind of like a puzzle here. There we go. Are there any more circle? Oh, this blue circle. What bad shape you're in. Bad shape circle. Very bad shape. I can buy a new nozzle? Oh, sure. Let me finish this blue and I can go buy one. I haven't even seen the shop yet. Like, I haven't personally seen it. Or I forgot about it if we did on Tuesday. Oh yeah, I forgot to like put on music. Mm 
Dun, 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 dun. Am I still prone? Oh no, this is really the highest view. Mm. Yeah, what, what, do you want the power washer to be really, I mean, I can crank it up if you want loud, I can make it loud. We can make your, we can make that a reality if you want that chat. I can crank it up. Missing that spot? Holy shit. Terrible accuracy on my part. Oops, I missed that completely. Yeah, right. Dirt, dirt, dirt. Gotta be loud enough to have to yell over it. Okay. Whoa, little secrets right here. Part's gonna be terrible. Alright, mega clean. Let's go. I think that car door right there. Wow, very generous. All right, is that all the rings? Ooh, look how bright it looks now. That is way nice. I like this. This makes me happy.
Oh, inside the trash can? Really? Oh, okay. All right. Have to be extra for that one. I'm doing inside the trash. Holy shit. This is the worst. This is the longest part. I was avoiding this for the longest time because it was going to take the longest. This stupid thing. Yeah, this is down, hands down the worst part. Ugh. kids here what are the kids doing here man all the hands that must have been on this disgusting oh my good lord this is a nightmare This sucks. Okay, I'm getting motion sick from that. Holy shit, stop. <laughs> I might have to use the other mode for this one. What was it? Okay, did it. I absolutely hate this. I don't want to do this job anymore. I might, I might go to another job. This part, I don't like this part. This is the hard part. Yeah, let's get that other nozzle, actually. Let's back up. And it looks a little better, but geez. All right, let's get to get that nozzle, so. I'll get to at least $1,000, yeah, I gotta get to 1000 first, yeah. Let's get this lower blue wall. I think this will get us to it. Definitely will now, once we get this. Almost there. Did we ever get the slide? Okay, we did get the slide. Oh my god, we're so close. Three dollars away. Wait, the stools? Oh, yeah, I can just clean these stools real quick. There's a multiple. That one looks pretty clean. Yeah, the hell? Oh, underneath them, I see. Um, 
Come on, give it to me. Count it, come on. What the fuck? There we go. Thousand dollars. Alright, shop. Power washers? Is it this? Is this it? The nozzles? These are the nozzles, right? Oh boy. Dude. Pro soap nozzle. Prime Vista long extension. Oh, I need to use cleaning liquids with this. Dude, let's get the Let's get these short extensions. Aren't these better? Do we get these cheap ones? Should we get these cheap ones first? Let's just buy let's start the cheap stuff. I'll start with these three. Let's try these three. Alright, and you wanna go back to liquids. Oh, these are pretty cheap, but they there's only so much you can use. See, in stock. Look at that. Clothing. Ooh, wash. Look at this. Modifications. Oh, that's to, to make your thing look different. Dude, we have only we have oh medium duty. Holy shit. Professional duty, five thousand dollars. Oh man, we can get the medium duty though, dude. I, I kind of want to do this. Don't I? I own this one, dude. Should we upgrade to this, dude? I bought three nozzles. Let's do it. I like this. I can't even. I, I not. I can't even. I haven't even unlocked this, so I should just get the medium duty. Let's do it. All right, so now how do I change my equipment? Main menu. Yeah, you know, where do I change my gear? What are the washers? What do you mean washers? That's what I just did, power washers. I checked these out. Yeah, right, I did this. All right, so did it already upgrade it, or hang on, it's right here. All right, so power washer. Urban, Ut oh my god, extension. Oh, do those extensions not work on the dial? Gotcha, okay, well, 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 let's try out the extensions first. It's fine, I I'm a completionist. Let's go back to this. Let's try the short extension. Let's try the this turbo nozzle. Oh, baby. Good for close quarters, it said. It was like did you see how it, like, look at this thing when it fired. Look at that. <laughs> look at that. Oh, my God. <laughs> look at that. Holy shit. You can't even hold it steady. Dude, the second one is, like, ridiculous. <laughs> Oh my god, it is like just destructive. Alright, let me try out uh and I wanna try the long extension, what that does. Oh my
What's the widest range? Oh, dear, dear. Can you just cheese it now? Yeah, that's not powerful enough. Let's try this. noise Let's try out the more powerful gun, though. Sorry. We don't have an extension for it, but we're just gonna use the regular nozzle. Oh my. Feels good. This, this is power, chat. Okay, this is the widest one? Holy shit. It, yeah, this is way faster. Oh my good lord, yeah, let's go. Let's get nice and clean now. Dude, it's so good. So easy now. Oh my, this is simple. Yo, racking up the cash now, let's go. Go, get me, give me that cash. Give me that cash. I need all that cash. Need all the cash, baby. Give me the cash. Gotta get paid so I could get the nozzle upgrades for this gun. There we go. Nice, nice. Let's go up like this. And nice, nice. Cross here. Nice, 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 nice. Uh, 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 oh, 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 oh. Was that a message or something? What was that? It's appeared out of nowhere or something. You know, like a... Is there... Oh god, even the backside's dirty too. Damn it. Dude, this playground's gonna be done in no time now. it up ding 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 nice very good oh yeah oh yeah clean clean for me Yo, bring on the buildings. Where are the giant buildings? I'm ready. All right, let's finish in here, actually. Let's, let's finish this side before we move on. Well, I was like those cleaning commercials, like, tough on grease. Like, I feel like that right now. Like those old commercials. This soap is tough on grease. I need a ladder to get up there, don't I? Soap scum, um, says save scumming, I'm um, soap scumming. 
Yeah, when I can add soap to this, oh man, are we gonna like destroy everything? shit or something. What is this shit? Ugh, this one's like the hardest. There we go. We get a little some higher pressure here. This one still needs some pressure, I guess. There we go. Nice. Ding. feeling dings right now chat oh shit I didn't see that all right I gotta get the ladder it's time for the ladder all right where's the ladder Ooh, this side right here Ugh. oh yeah I forgot about the auto fire my finger was starting to hurt. I'm like, why is it hurting? Oh, I'm not doing auto fire. Ooh, so good. All the I mean, diagonal motions kind of harder. So close. Again there, chat. It's very close. I just go like the outside here or something. Yeah, there we go. Hey, this job is worth way more than thousand dollars. Not gonna lie. These guys got me for a steal. Taking me for a bit of a ride right here. Dopamine! That sound effect, holy shit. Oh, oh fuck me off. Oh, the top of the monkey bars probably have you up there, huh? Dude, that is like bird shit. God, gross. Ugh. Look at that ray tracing on display though right now. Uh, where's the ladder? Bingo! Ho ho ho! Let's clean this sucker. Yeah. Next gen showpiece, you are absolutely right. Let's make this wider. There we go. Oh yeah. The 
Boom. I actually know the lyrics to that song. I didn't know the lyrics to that song forever. Nice song in general that people just like know like the refrain or something or the chorus and they don't know like the rest of the song. Dude, what spot am I missing here? Where is it? Where is it? I'm going nuts here. Ah, there we go. Bing! Ding, 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 ding. How do I get in here? Dude, this is the worst. This looks terrible. Let me get down. Oh, actually. Can I use this? Yeah. Oh, here we go. Shit, turbo time. Yeah, I wanted to have this done before the podcast is over. I don't think I'm going to do that. It's already 7. I do need to probably get going. Can't be out too late, unfortunately. Oh, I got access to the back now. Yeah, here we go. Soothing. How much of this is left? I don't understand why you're not done. That looks pretty clean to me, bud. Even that part of Ding. Ding. dopamine right now. Swings and railway. What? What the hell is he saying? Get down. Oh, there was the grind. There we go. Ah, here we go. Oh my gosh, such a good noise. Sounds like payday. Payday the heist. Oh 
Man, this feels good. Remember, we're doing this for the kids. This is all for the kids, chat. That's right, yeah, the kindness of your heart to these kids. Don't even look at the value, the money at the end of this, the, the bill, the invoice. Don't even focus on that. This is all for the children. Oh, the back of these, you do. Hmm. Interesting. Interior is disgusting. Man, this is disgusting, man. Traffic worse in New York or LA? San Francisco? New York probably is worst. Yeah, I think New York is probably worse. Oh dear, I got a little weird on me for a sec there. It was not 
Feeling good. Getting a little nauseous. They say when the camera moves in a way I'm not expecting it to move is what makes me motion sick. When it moves how I'm expecting it to move, no issues. When it moves when I'm not how I'm expecting it to move, we have problems. Oh man, this floor is this. Look my footsteps, dude. I just noticed my footsteps. Yeah, I didn't notice that before. Time out. Traffic is the mind killer. Uh, I saw. Is that thing getting passed that Bill build better back? Whatever actually is happening now. Thankfully. Dude, I hate LA traffic. I hate. I just hate traffic. I hate how there's like all this space, like just going up. It's like, you're constrained by limitations. It's like, oh, uh, in like 100, 100, 200 years, we're still around, we're gonna laugh at like people that like to wait in traffic and cars like, what? Why don't they have this or something? It's like, oh my God, how did they ever wait? Yeah, whatever it's called now, Inflation Reduction Act. Does that, does that have infrastructure stuff? Like, we could get, like, better infrastructure? I don't know. I did not see the video of John Stewart from this morning. What was it? We're talking about Daily Show John Stewart, right? This dude does need a double jump. I bet there's an unlock for a double jump at some point. I bet it happens. I believe. I want to believe. I want to believe, chat. Hey, aren't you supposed to be watching the behind the scenes of the podcast if you're a patron right now? Not supposed to be here. You're just watching the podcast. Go up your Patreon and go watch the podcast. You don't have to watch this, dude. How much do you think the double jump will cost, though? It's gotta be pricey. Real world double jump. Do we want it? Like you gotta be a billionaire. If you're a billionaire, you can afford a double jump in real life. That's like the pricing on that sucker. Like absolutely will be like something only billionaires can afford. Not even millionaires will be able to get a double jump. Hey, where's the rest of this dirt? Oh, it must be on like the exterior. That's right. There we go. So for jetpack, that's gonna be like millionaire only thing. And very, very limited, unfortunately. 
Ooh, this one's gonna be. Oh, dear, dear, don't crash the game. I miss all these spots, man. I don't know if this is the most efficient way, but I'm doing it. Damn, is this not done? Oh, it's really good. There we go. Are these the same? They're not. Oh dear. Dude, how am I supposed to get these spots? What the fuck? Got yeah, that one. So Yeah, I guess you gotta get the ladder, huh? Alright. Oh come on, that's like the end. Crime for me. Your poster now has come and said how cute Tubi is. It's Yoko Taro, huh? Viral marketing confirmed, huh? We are all just pawns to Yoko Taro. Pawns in his play called Life. I think Yoko Taro is going to have a power wash simulator in Nier 3. Do you think it's going to be called Nier 3? Like, or like Nier something? Or do you think it's going to have a new name? Do you think he's going to keep Nier as the name? Oh, 
But he calls it far. Yeah, that's pretty good. Disgusting. Man, does this mean children are just this gross? Is that what this game is trying to teach me right now? Is that children are nasty and dirty? If you're a parent, is that accurate? I hate how I can't tell if those are shadows or dirt. I've only had a tool that told me. Accurate as fuck. Oh boy. I was saying, I think I said a little bit, like it was nice when my family visited in March and I got to see my nephews. My mom was saying like, oh, it's like you're so good with them and like spend, you like, can spend time with them. I was like, yes, because A, they're not mine and B, <laughs> I get to like go away at some point and not be around them and have a break, whereas their parents don't get that luxury. <laughs> they have to be around them all the time. I was like, that's the difference. Like, I fully understand why some parents are like, oh my god, save me, please help me. I think I would, like, go insane. I've had too much, uh, too much time of, like, a, being alone and having myself prioritized, it's like, don't know if I can make that switch at my age. Like, in short burst, I'm like, great, they're wonderful, but like, long term, I, want, I do worry that like, I don't have the mental capacity to deal with that. Like, I'd just check out at some point. And that would not be good at all, so... You know, probably not put myself in that situation. Not fair. cats they're not the same though you don't have to have conversations with the cat you don't have to like at a certain age you don't have to like start like engaging with your cat like in the certain ways like or, or dog either it's like it's not this it's not the same I'm not trying to compare like like no, it's not talking about like affection and love here I'm just talking about like development development and responsibility it's not the same level I absolutely will concede that point every single parent is like it's not I will tell you I don't have kids and I know it's not the same now if anyone tries to tell you that like your cat dog or whatever isn't as like emotionally important to you as a parent's child is we can have that debate I will absolutely hear those arguments but in terms of difficulty it's not the same level is a good step up in responsibility yes it is not the same level as, yeah, as being a, like, a human parent. 
All right, we're almost done here. What are we missing? Okay. So I make sure I got. Oh my god, this is disgusting. This, is, you know what? I, I, I put your kids away. This, this is like flashing a black light in a like a fucking strip club or something. This is what I feel like I'm looking at right now. I feel disgusting. This, this is the vibe I'm getting right now. Not, not happy times. It just, yeah, it's just everywhere and it's not coming out. It'll never come out. God, look at these spots. Holy shit. I need to go out to the exterior. Like we got, oh yeah, this is like a big chunk. I like the jumping, the platforming's great. Oh, just in here. Oh yeah, we got under here too. Man, we got a lot. This new gun though is definitely worth the investment. Absolutely. Alright, here we go. One stretch. Oops. And like how many spots he just missed the old gun. That's like insane. What you miss? That's like insane. I want to bring the ladder over here, actually. Clean the top of your fan blades, man. In your room, if you have a spinning fan, like a ceiling fan, sorry. That's what the tops of them probably look like if you've never cleaned them before. You're in for surprise. Spots you miss, man, it's insane. Ninety-eight percent, we're so close, chat.
Oh, wow. Okay, we missed this whole side. Jeez. this. Still got this. Man, I got a lot of tiny things here I'm missing. Alright. Tower vertical struts. What am I missing on this one? Okay. This one says I'm missing some. What am I missing? Okay. Anything else? Maybe. Okay. This one I'm missing some right there, really? Oh. On the inside? Right here, maybe? There we go, nice. Alright, the floor. I'm missing some on the floor here. Cool, that's that too. Floor, what am I missing? Come on. There we go. Alright, slide guard. I'm missing some stuff here. Alright, that's good. Other slide guard. We're good. That's good. That is not. We'll get down there in a sec. Alright, roof is good. That is not done. Alright, we got something here. Oh, yeah, we got some dirt here. Nice. Oh, and this is not done either. That is now done. That one really missing here. Come on. We're missing. Ah, there we go. Oh, come on, man. It's clean. There we go. Jeez. 99% chat. This should be the last spot. Come on. Come on. Yeah. All right. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Oh, wait, wait. All right. Let's move this lower table right here. There's something there. Are you dreaming it? Oh, there it was. Slide platform. There we go. Ding, ding, ding. Wait. Oh, I just got it. 
All right, these are not done though. Yeah. All right, which one's not done still? All right, these. are all good. Wait. Ding. Alright, those are all good. Alright, check these. That one's not good. Okay. I have to go on the outside for that one as well. There we go. Got what are we missing? Oh my God, what's left? Oh wait, lower tower wall. Other side of it? I saw it. What was it? Shit. What am I missing, Jeff? Ah! Uh, Do I see the list of stuff again? Where does it say not? Okay, hand, 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 slow down. How do I slow? Oh my god, this scrolling sucks. Alright. Tower roof support. All right, tower roof support, the tower trim. So it's some kind of tower. It's a strut. These are supports. Where is support? Where is this? Ah, there it is. Got to get up here. All right, that's one. Tower vertical struts. Am I supposed to highlight this? Vertical struts. Not that one. Not that one. Not that one.
Huh? Oh, it's this one. There we go. Alright. Tower trim, tower support strip two. Tower trim, what's a trim? Wait, I, I saw one. Here we go. Oh my god, how much more is there? Which ver oh, are there are vertical struts down here. I maybe missed hand. There it is. Tower trim. Should be glowing, right? Ow. Trim. All right, where is it? God, we're done. Woo! I want to leave this on and leave it for them to see. I want to go home now. How oh, much more? Is yeah, my battery, my phone's about to die. I need to go. Um. I kind of want to leave the stream on so you can see their their reaction. Where's that sign? Mm, I don't know when they're going to be done. So, for those who have access to the Patreon, to the behind the scenes, are they in love and respect yet, or no? <laughs> He were played Hitman for part of the group stream, but I don't know if that was a new level. Yeah. Huber's farted. So have others. People have definitely farted on stream. 100%. Oh uh, no, I need to, I want to go home. I'm hungry and tired, so I'm going to go to sleep. I want to eat and lie down. Lightning will keep an eye out. I, I wanted to see if they were almost done so I could wait a few more minutes to see the reaction to this. Seriously, think this should be like easy living. We should come up with a new name. 
We should come up with a new name and call it like something power wash. Easy wa easy washing. E or easy cleaning. Yes. Easy cleaning, easy washing. And I think it should just be this game. Where we get Jones to show up? No, I'm not gonna leave the stream on. I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the game on so they could see. Alright. Thanks everyone. I'm gonna head out. I will see you next Tuesday? I will not be at the stream tomorrow, so I will see you all, uh, I'll see you at the, uh, Tuesday. I'll see you Tuesday. So, enjoy your weekend. Bye.